There we go. <clears throat> yeah. So we're here we are again. I said that I thought that I would uh, go and do uh, start from a certain point in the story, but I figured I'd, I'd actually just do everything over because it's. Uh, I know I failed a couple of things, and I would like to try and not fail them. <clears throat> so. Round two. Bye. We can do a new story. We'll still play on forgiving. Uh, new slots. We alternative pass through the story. Uh, uh, not not quite ready for the alternative pass through the story. Not not yet. Although it is kind of tempting. Maybe after we do it perfectly, when we're, <clears throat> we're killing everyone, we can tr try the alternative as well. That would be interesting at least to try. Me. Maybe. We'll see. But we'll do the, the theatrical uh, uh, normal stuff. So here, as they say, here we go again. No fumbling of the fingers this time, please. Uh, preferably. <clears throat> Sorry. <laughs> Just eating food. Uh, others. I'll leave you dead. I still think that Raven is the curator. We, we always hear Raven. The wheel is 264 feet, Jeff. Can you imagine it? We are in 1893. I bet you can see for a hundred miles at the top. We should make that our first priority. Whatever pleases you the most. You please me the most. You mean you are not weary of me after the entire <sighs> They're day so cute. Marriage? And then you know they're gonna I die. Never <clears throat> it's sad. Sad day. My dear. <laughs> Marie and Jeff. I think we've arrived. Pharmacy and hotel all in one. Isn't this grand? As advertised. Very nice. A good chandelier, though. Let's check in. <laughs> Are we the only ones here? I'm sure that was a mad dash first thing this morning to get to the fair. Try again? Well, this does not bode well for the level of service we're in store for. Wait, I forgot to get, grab something. I'm sorry. Just really quickly gonna go get it. It only takes like a minute. Hello, Isa. Hello. 
Hello, Ether. How are you doing? Hope you've had a wonderful day. Huh. I've had an okay day. Work, oh. work. <laughs> hmm. Let's see. Continue. Hmm. We're playing uh, the same game again. <laughs> Let's sign in and go yep. straight there. I'm not going anywhere if no one checks us in. We will join after coffee, I think. Slow service. That means they're making sure everything is perfect. That's my Marie. Always finding that silver line. When will um, Sis be joining? I think she's out my for coffee apologies. and snack, and then she'll be joining after. For both startling you and for making you wait. My attention was... At least that's what she said. Okay. I promise from here on out it will be nothing He's not but creepy at all. No. Welcome to the World's Fair Hotel. Please sign in here. First time in Chicago. I'm going to hazard a guess and assume you're here to take in the exposition. The fair, yes, but that's not all. Today is a very special day for us. Oh, a honeymoon. How very, very lovely. <clears throat> Perhaps my wife, Mrs. Whitman, would like to sign. <laughs> yes, today's the beginning of our honeymoon. Congratulations. In that case, an upgrade is in order. A honeymoon suite it is. Oh, well, uh, are the rates that much higher? <laughs> I think nothing of it. The same rates as your regular room. The upgrade is on us. You're our first honeymooners. How kind. Thank you, Mr. Holmes. Henry Howard Holmes. You have a lovely hotel, Mr. Holmes. Well, yeah, I can Thank do this. Very much. I... Just very quickly. You can watch it if you want. Then you see it without delay. Mm. Thank you. <coughs> oh, not feeling that well then, maybe? Uh, no, I just got to eat in my lungs. Oh. Uh, I've heard that if you just cough them up and wash them, you feel straight better. <laughs> My dad used a joke that you could cough them up and wash them and you would mm -hmm. feel better. Built most of it myself. <clears throat> I never man managed to get that to work. Architect, designer, builder, man, many talents. Doctor, artist. I'm a man of many interests. Impressive. Please, have a look around. We have sundries and gifts at the pharmacy counter. I'll take your luggage up to your room and ensure that everything is in order. Just make a note if you decide to purchase anything, and we will add it to your bill. You're thinking, yes, I'll make sure that your room is in order. Just read that as Thank set you, up Mr. the death traps. We appreciate it. The pleasure is all, all the death. I guess I can pick the other thing here, the the bottle. Do the now, face powder last time. What did I forget to bring? Not that I think that in in any will will change the end of uh, these two. Oh, pardon me, miss. Careful, you. My husband gets awfully cross with men who act fresh. Hmm. He sounds like a ripe fellow. How's the marriage going? Lovely. Thanks for asking. Well, let's just head up. I'm sure the room is ready. 
see anything good over there at the jewelry counter? I still have problems regarding the fact that I was like, who is that guy? And my brain just went like, just see like the small <laughs> clock going around like, when is he going to understand what the fuck is going on? I know, but, right? And finally my brain went, oh, wait, I know. Ah, uh, oh, yes. You can literally see the bell go. I wonder what's in here. <laughs> yeah. That is funny though. I watched a streamer earlier today who was playing this and they didn't know who H.H. H. Holmes was. Well, they've heard the name, but they didn't know about him. There's actually quite a few cool videos to watch afterwards. Like backstories and stuff. That's going to be fun. See what happens when you chase a thrill? If this is you trying to get out of the Ferris wheel. I know you won't be denied. Wait, what's that? Ghosty. Okay, let's, I will try not to fail this this time around. I failed it last time. You failed this one as well? Yeah, I've, I managed to fail the mm. first one here. The last time I, the first time I played. But it doesn't actually do anything. It just... They have to explain why they're in there. Hmm. I mean, one thing... It, it is a known fact that he was a murderer, but... I mean, they... The newspapers also did, like, <laughs> really... You won't think it's thrilling if we're sleeping on the street after getting kicked out of here. Like, really, like, said... His hotel was, like, it was it's filled with... Thou dozens of torture chambers and all that. Then again, his hotel was fucking creepy. The hotel was built for one thing only. Mm. To kill people. And then hide it afterwards. Which is... I mean, in its own way, it's brilliant when that's your intention in life. Welcome, newlyweds, to the honeymoon suite. <laughs> Thank you kindly. Mr. Holmes. Yes, the weirdest smile that did. I, I, I was about to say, what the fuck is wrong with that smile? <laughs> to return to. It looks creepy. Then again, I'm these sure games have like an uncanny valley with their faces, so you've kind of gotten used to it by now. <laughs> <laughs> Goodness, this place is fit for a king. It's a shame that they die. I like them. They're oh, cute. You. Kiss this. They're kind of untypical for their their time of 1893. Hey! Ah. Bullseye! You asked for it. <laughs> Should I be frightened? If you're smart. Oh no, you don't. You will not forgive you. <laughs> mercy, mercy. Okay, you win. Anything broken? Only my pride. How about a peace offering? Hmm. This feels like some sort of treacherous plot. Not at all. I have a He looks like he could be a serial killer if we're honest. Close your eyes face the mirror aren't you clever and romantic if I get a pillow to the face I will sock you right in the kisser <laughs> is there a problem no open your eyes there you see the bearing thing Repurchase rose water, and we got the necklace. Oh, Jeff, it's lovely. I love it. Good. Victory is mine. I'll let you have that bath now. <laughs> Camera. Well, peeping hole, I guess.
at that time it would probably be just a peeping hole, not a camera. It feels like a very time correct hotel. It's jammed shut. Maybe if we put a little Vault eight into it? before the temple. So, yes. Open sesame. <laughs> Thank you. Why don't you have a shave while I take a quick bath? Then we can reconvene. I know that word. It's French for something illicit. <laughs> Shush. Shave. I think I forgot to pack my razor and kit. I'm sure the pharmacy downstairs has them. Don't be too long in that bath. Don't you worry. So much flirting. We know that we're not even gonna find the bathrooms. Or the pharmacy, because... We will find the trap. Mm. But... But, um, Isa, regarding the murder hotel, yeah. a lot of it is fictionalized. Of but course. Did, but, but again, I mean, how could you not make a story out of it? Because no. it, it is just so insane. I think, in a way, it it makes it more believable, especially at the time, mm. to make it a bit more... Like the newspapers now do. Make everything a little mm. bit more sensational, a little bigger, a little yeah. scarier. I could have sworn this was the way we came up. Yeah, I'm sorry, my dear, but that's changed. And in the next playthrough, everybody's gonna be assholes. After this one. And he's gonna die here. <laughs> it's basically the run where I fail everything. It's fun. What? Ah! And he will fall in there. And we'll see death death. That would be really cool though if you like won a whole lot of money for the fun of it. Imagine building a replica of the hotel as best you can do and use it as a kind of escape room game. I think you I think you could, but you have to like convince people who says, now listen, I know somebody have done this before. And they actually was... killed people, but this is just for an escape room, we promise. We promise. Our lawyer is right there. He will tell you it's okay. <laughs> Just go but believe us. But that, trust yeah, me. trust me. Everything is gonna be fine. Nobody is gonna disappear in it. No, no. But it would be fun though. And I mean, the first I, I, guest you're gonna get is the the people who love or are intrigued by H. H. Holmes. Oh my! What have you walked in on? Yes, you could wonder that, Barry. A bath. And I, I, I would imagine that, that you, you could make like a very s successful uh, hotel. Mm -hmm. But oh, are we playing another game? That's not Jeff, honey. But we did the investigate, so let's do the relax just to see different ways she's gonna die. But yeah, making that hotel, uh, a hotel copy as best you can would be interesting. You know, this as an escape room kind of thing. Big. I think there might be room for another body. I think there's been plenty of bodies oh. in that bathtub already. Mm, that's nice. That's not gonna stay nice. Ow. You don't know your own strength. Easy, dear. That's not your dear, honey. Jeff, that hurts. Hello, my dear. <gasps> I mean, I she should have reacted to the fact that the door never was uh, first made a sound. I really thought we'd have a little more fighting in Oh, did we do? We have a bottle. Good girl. Sorry about that. No, no worries. We're just having her drowned, apparently, in this version. Yeah, yeah. I, I don't know why. Um... I got disconnected, apparently. Oh! Yeah, in the previous one I took the box and I investigated, and then she gets her throat cut. This time she just gets drowned.
Lovely. I wonder how many people have ended their life in that bathtub. What are you doing? If you've touched Maria, you're a bit late with that sentiment, good sir. Your wife is already dead, honey. Dead as a doornail. Is there a problem, sir? <laughs> I even found out what that gas is most likely to be the thing pushed into the room. Mustard gas? No, lighting gas. Mm. It's the same gas that they used at the time to mm. light the, keep the lights light. And it's <laughs> deadly if you breathe. So it would be a natural thing to have in a hotel. Just not like that. I think the other death was actually a bit more heartbreaking because then she was still alive and they're on each side of the glass. Yeah, and then he would and then he would cut her throat, I guess. Yeah, he cut her throat partly and then he'd make sure that he did the rest of it in front of him while he was dying, just mm -hmm. to like really rub it in. That is some bug eyes. Mm-hmm. It is. And of course that he actually does that. Makes you wonder all of the stuff he has there. Is it yeah. all guests? A place for everything. Everything in its place. Well, look at this. Oh, oh, round two. Wonderful. Only the best for you, my dear. Mother would simply die. It's so I say, opulent. good man, do you work here? Hello. Welcome to the World's Fair Hotel. Hello, Vendor Stories. We will always watch the intro because you do not take away the curator. I mean, he has such a great voice. He has such a good intro, too. Hello, Vendor Stories. Won't you spare me over till another year? I mean, in your playthrough, you only have like that one fuck up. Yeah. But it it must be annoying. And we I killed a couple it. of prompts as well, but nothing that killed anyone. But yeah, one one thumb fuck up and it was gone. Yeah. Maybe you maybe you could have survived it if you hadn't taken the uh, you know uh, the screwdriver. Nah, she she needs a screwdriver later. We didn't see that scene because she died. <laughs> yeah, makes sense. And I'm good when the story is, how are you doing? We're back to this again. I love this music. I mean, I can't remember, what was the one called where you are on, where you are on the ghost ship? Man of Madan. Yeah, Man of Madan. The story of Man of Madan is so insane. Yep. It is very out there. Mm. But it's just a perfect creepy story. It is. And it reminds me a lot of Ghost Ship, uh, mm. an old movie. This is making me think, do you know the raven we keep seeing? Mm -hmm. The fact that he just had a feather fall yeah. off while he walked by Have makes me wonder if he's the raven that keeps an eye on everything. Welcome back. Maybe. I do enjoy seeing a familiar face. But this is going to be the save all run, on to Hopefully. 
But if one dies, it's going to be to kill everyone. Be to save them all. <laughs> we will enter Plan B. Kill all. It's so good to have company. For a long time, I was on my own. I can barely recall a time when I wasn't here, watching over these tales. And what good are stories without somebody to experience them? Hmm? Sister, it makes me this wonder. Story to be honest, I wouldn't be surprised if they actually make a story the when you speak like of the Raven that he is the uh, be made pure. Uh, the Raven from Edgar Allan Poe's uh, poet. Mm -hmm. Can elicit all sorts of reactions. Because Delight, uh, his room and all that, it always yes, gives me... But also down it always leaped my mind to uh, Edgar Allan Poe. It has some of the same vibes, absolutely. Mm. I very much agree with you. The Telltale Heart? Yeah. Hidden in the, world. the Raven, which we always yeah. see. Yeah. Both in the stories and glimpses occasionally in glimpses here as well. Of your choices. And sometimes it's the smallest choices that can have the biggest repercussions. Why did you eat Mexican today? Why were you so far away from the toilet? <laughs> Bad choices. <laughs> Bad <laughs> One small choice. Great repercussions. Very much In a way, it's not wrong. I can only observe yeah, what also, it's, it's and just stupid and silly because you kind of ruin, like, the magic of the game. Yeah. When you say st shit like that, but I have to because ah. I am a scary cat. You know what? We've played through this once with mostly dignity, but we're here to have fun. They put them in the mouth of the recently deceased to pay the ferryman. Ah, the opals. Look out for them. You'll find them in the strangest places. No, I'm, I'm already I'll looking forward to the next next game too. We are running through space. Oh, the one in oh. space. Oh. Season two. <laughs> Well, shall we start? Yes, we shall. The game is afoot. Uh -huh. I will be watching. Well, let's go. My name is Kate Wilder. I've got a master's in criminal psychology. I'm an investigative journalist and hope to make a difference. You may have recently seen my interview on Chicago AM on... Straight to the insecurities. And, uh... And yeah, it's really tough when just being honest means everyone thinks you're a bitch. <laughs> I'm not sure I've got issues to deal with, same as everyone. I I'm working on it. I. Hey, I'm Mark. I study photography at UCLA. Um, at a great time. Really want to get back into some serious photography. Good uh, God, yeah, those it's, eyes. Uh, He's like the most boring character of them all. Mm -hmm. I've been a key group in lighting tech for years. Your She's one of the best. Hmm. But yet she died. I know. Someone like that. Man, how do you even start? I don't like it. <laughs> I'm sick of being on my own. Sorry, do you start with qualifications or um? I know she can die very, very fast. I don't, I mean, Erin, hmm. that is. She is the first one that can die. Uh, yeah, hmm. Charlie Lonnit. UK originally, uh, been here for he kind of grew on me through the uh, through the gameplay. The, the fun thing is, Charlie actually grew on me, but that's more like because he realized, you know what, I've probably been a dick. Yeah, I, I'm still looking forward to doing the um, the asshole run, which is also the kill all yeah. run, where he's gonna be a right shitty asshole. Yeah. And that dinner they have is gonna be very different. Enough. Oh, I've barely begun, Your Honor. You Who's that guy? Understand. He looks so familiar, the judge. I was born mm -hmm. with the devil in me. The judge looks familiar. I could not help the fact that I was a murderer any more than a poet can help the inspiration to sing. Bury me deep, Your Honor. Make sure they fill my pine box with cement. Put me deeper than anyone else. And cover the ground with more cement. Cause trust me. Just being the light in his eyes is very fascinating. From killing again. On May 7th, 1896, Herman Mudgett, a.k.a. Henry H. Holmes, was sent to the gallows. His neck did not snap from the force of hanging. Records indicate he hung slowly suffocating for over 15 minutes until finally the monster was dead america's first serial killer confessed to 27 murders 
but his investigators sifted through the traces he left behind, following his path from city to city. The number grew significantly, nearly 200 lives. America's first serial killer, and possibly the worst. He was buried as requested, under concrete. Was he hoping to hide from God's judgment? Or did he truly want to keep the devil from climbing out and killing again? So, what do you think? <laughs> to be honest, Charlie, this is a pilot. Hold that thought. Lonnet Entertainment. Charles Lonnet, please. Speaking. Charlie is fine. My name is Grantham Dumet. What can I do for you, Mr. Dumet? Actually, it's what I can do for you. Hear me out. Very fascinating what the I'm certainly great Mr. Dumet is. This all sounds amazing, but I uh I just turns into. I'm waiting mm. to hear what the catch is. No offense. None taken. I'm in a privileged position. I don't need for much, but my time is at a premium. We need to do this today. I'll send a car for you this afternoon, 4 p.m. Be ready. This afternoon? We're talking a couple of days shoot. I've told my team they're free this weekend, and frankly, they're a temperamental bunch. Without them, this conversation is dead in the water. We, uh... I've told you what I have. Please don't waste my time. Am I sending the car or not? Yes, of course. We're in. I'll get them there. I promise. Let's do it. <laughs> what can go wrong on a small secluded island in a murder castle? We... Right. Let's load up, guys. I got it. I'm good. <laughs> Sorry. Are you? I mean, this is that that makes it all glowing. Think leave it behind if you're right. This is going to be grand, people. Adventure. It's going to be doom. Excitement. Anyone? Well, it's not doom yet. <laughs> it's going to be doom in a second. Uh, hopefully it's not going to be doom this time around. But the, the next time around it's really going to be doom. It's going to be fail everything and you're all going to die. Do we know where we're going exactly? The, the thing is, however, that is a problem, is that they should have been able to see the limousine driver as he drove up and he's wearing fucking plastic gloves. No money in my pocket, if a dead phone, you'd and think so, yeah. That wasn't my fault. But it seems like the entire limo has like dark hints. So, come on, Charlie. What do we know about this guy? He's rich, he's a recluse, he's obsessed with H.H. Holmes. Totally sane, I'm sure. We're going to a property he inherited from a relative. That's who had the obsession with Holmes. Wasn't it if you Some of the rooms are do an anagram on Henry Mudgett, you get Grantham Dumet? Dumet has blueprints, documents, artifacts. When I said this would save the Think show, so. I was not exaggerating. And you substantiated all of this? Just trust me. Sorry for all the mystery. Before we go any further, I have to ask that we lock up your phones for safekeeping. While this may sound strange that I invite you to film the collection inside my home, I cannot allow any personal devices that Was may share information that could affect my this? business or lifestyle. There are rules. All footage you wish to use must be authorized by me first. I require privacy and discretion. I must insist. His place, his rules. Look, what he's offering us is worth it. Could be making us pay, but he isn't. If this is all he asks, then we'll Oh, do it. but he will be. Fine. <laughs> For this this is all he does. He just like, wants a little blood. This is gonna be great. <laughs> like you what said everybody says. Either. It's not like he wants something. Oh, know. yes, he's not a recluse. He has a murder house. Yeah, I mean, they are blatantly ignoring every red flag in the book. <laughs> I, I want to leave, please. Like, let's see. On an island. Murder castle. Extreme fascination mm. with H.H. Holmes. 
No mobile phone. Is this due to Sir Rich? Shouldn't he have servants or something? Uh, how many red flags do we have? All of them. <laughs> no, really. I got it. Thanks, bro. Don't sweat it. Jackass. A driver that picks you up that you can't see. An entirely black wind of limo that you can't see okay. into at all. So now I, I just want to know how the fuck he could look out of the windows. There's probably like the, the darkened type where it's easy to look out but not in. That's certainly um, up there. Up there. The, the visuals will be great. Mr. Chicken. Frame up over the mist. Charlie, you'll hack up a lung before you're halfway up there. I'm fit as a butcher's dog. Mark, this is crazy. We'll be fine. Let's go, Charlie. Be careful, guys. Nice knowing you. <laughs> Come on. Oh, yeah, we play Charlie. <laughs> Again, straight away, I am a recluse who has inherited this place and immediately, wow, this place is pretty fucking shabby. Yeah, let, let's see. He's a multimillionaire. He could at least like keep it in like slightly no, better shape no than this. Yeah, no form of like danger sense still. We do the thingy. To Daisy. And you don't like the fact that everything is so hey, run down. Hurry up. We're on it. Ooh, hello. Hello, Mr. Curator. I think that's you. Hello. I suspect that the flying thing is you. Jesus, that is loud. It's meant to be heard from miles away. I can't see oh, yeah, a single boat though. I'm a little bit disappointed. Hmm. Oh, so much for plan A. We must be able to work our way around. It does look like an edit finch house, you are correct. Anything for a shot, right? Warning, cliff erosion. These cliffs are subject to erosion. And may collapse into deep water without warning. Nah, this sign is something the lawyers made them put up. I'm sure it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> it's not like everything here seems to be. Yeah, no, it's not like it shitty. looks like thing has already fallen in, like the entire yeah. bridge. No, no. And it looks like everything else is in pretty shitty conditions. Nah, they just may were forced to put that. Yeah, up. yeah, yeah. That's just a lawyer thing. The fact that this lamp just isn't even say, standing um, straight anymore. No big deal. No big deal. Up, None whatsoever. Getting this footage. No, for the whole trip. This looks like a fireplace. You know, some bit. of the crew can be challenging to work with. Jamie and Kate would never have agreed to come if you hadn't been on board. I figured that the episode was such a mess, we needed all the help we could get. Right. Yeah. I guess we do. Yeah, guys, you do. He has the weirdest jogging style, I'm sorry. Anything in here? No? No? Just a dark spot? You were looking for a coin? Yeah, coin, secret, stuff I missed the first okay. time, you know. I won't lie. I was hoping being here, all remote and away from the world, that maybe I'd have some downtime, some space to decompress. Downtime? Why would you want to do that? You know, relax a bit. I've never seen the attraction. Oh, you like to work yourself to death. That's what you like. In memory of the... Must have been quite a storm. Memory of the victims of the Great Storm of May 1st, 1907, in which 187 lives were lost. Crew and passengers of the SS Cassiopeia, which crashed into the rocks at the base of these cliffs. As they say. Oops. <laughs> what? Nothing, I just imagine, like the captain. This is your captain speaking. I might have overcooked this a little bit. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> My bad. Sorry. I cocked up the driving. My apologies. Uh, best of luck. Please try and swim to shore. I mean, we're, hit we're hitting a cliffside. It can't be that bad, right? 
I mean, how blind is Charlie when he tries the door instead of the completely open gate? Oh, yes, it is very... Oh, look at my... That is the lighter works pretty good. Hey, when we wrap, I'd like to take a couple weeks off. Go see my family. I need you in post. I really appreciate that discerning eye of yours, you know. I got a lot going on at the moment, Charlie. Oh, right. Yeah, of course. Sure. Take a couple of weeks. Shimmy. Yeah, I, I still want to point I'll out that that lighter with the fridge... Mm -hmm. Horrible. Oh, sorry. My fucking God. Got any family? You can go and buy Anyone could see that. Oh, well, that's like the worst you thing ever. You got hiding in some closet somewhere. Married to the job. Married to the job. <laughs> How's that marriage working out? Well, from what I hear about real marriages, it's pretty damn good. <laughs> well, I mean, there are some marriages that's probably worse than the job. For a brief moment, I was about to say, isn't there someone up there? Nope. It's just the uh, the thing that lights, yeah. isn't it? It is just the lights. Because my brain immediately says, there's a guy up there. I don't think there is uh, a guy up there. I don't remember uh. there being anyone up there. I do remember there being a jump scare pretty soon, though. So you're uh, aware. Thank you. Yeah, now. See? Christ, what the hell is that? A mannequin. You know, just hanging out. Maybe it's part of some old museum. I want to say, that fucking freaked right. me the fuck out, That's even if you told me. It is, uh... I legit, legit jump backed. It is actually a very effective scare because you're so focused on the bird. Mm. Bird has your attention and then they throw something else at you. It's sneaky but very effective. Danger, keep out. Yes, let's go through it. Coming. Yeah. I like the way. Look at the way he draws. Like this. <laughs> How is that going to fit into the show? I mean, you should be able to find. And there should be a coin here, unless you found it already. I found one, but I think it resets in. There's a lot of crossover between the creative stuff and the commercial stuff. Mm. Found it in the you first run, that. so it should be here somewhere. Crossover with Kate hasn't exactly. We agreed been. to let that drop for the weekend. Just making sure your head's in the game. I think mm -hmm. maybe it's later. Remember this? Fish factory. Oh yeah, it's exciting. exciting times. I mean, that makes sense as well because H. H. Holmes owned a, a factory where they mean he used it to burn away all the evidence against them. Yep. I mean, it's a very effective way of getting rid of evidence, burning it. I mean, it is. Either that or acid, acid tubs. Hmm. Those also work. Fairly well. But I mean, there's Breaking more Bad smell is... from the acid tubs than... Uh... Yeah, but Breaking Bad clearly shown. <laughs> How, what is the best way to get rid of a body? Acid tubs. Hmm. A dude smoothie. Mmm, tasty. Oh. I know. I agree with you on the... Ooh. Oh. It's I locked. Remember there being something here, but it might not be on the second run to run sure. Maybe it wasn't here. So. Shimmy. Shimmy shimmy. And of course then you get like this slightly ominous music just to hint that the mm. shit's gone. You're taking notes, Venice Toys. Why would you do that? Uh, reasons, is my uh, assumption. 
absolutely need to get that shot. Let me completely ruin all the clothes I have on. Yes, let's just crawl into this uh, stony crap here. That's fine. Mm -hmm. Wow, the power. Hey, hello there, Mr. Crow. Oh, there, there's the coin. Hi, curator. <laughs> This looks pretty old. We need to uh, unlock it. Oh my god, I for a moment I thought it says a toe clip, so it's like, why the fuck does he have that? Tie clip, tie clip. Yeah, yeah, I didn't know it was a tie clip, but my Unlocked brain went. Unlocked by a run. We need to try and do that, baby. Get up. Oh yeah, so they do actually count. You are. Current number. Look, sorry I give you a hard time now and again, but I really couldn't make these shows without you. That's not true. I may be driving this car. What car? A Lonnet Entertainment car. But you're the one who keeps the engine going. It's not how cars work. Jesus, you try and give someone a compliment. Thanks, Charlie. I get it. Never gonna be easy. It's a tutorial, of course, so it's because they want you Never to use this. Never gonna get it. Never gonna. I'm flying because we need to push it first. Wait, we need to go on this this side. I really do not like this part. I think it's really clunky to handle them. I mean, it does look clunky. And then, hey, and in the side, the house we go. Because why not, right? Yeah, because just fuck it. Breaking and entering. Yeah, just a little breaking. <laughs> just a little breaking and entering, you know? Nothing yeah, serious. He says it. Man says it. Christ, what the hell is that? Uh, a dog? Is that a dog? Nice to meet you too. Is it a dog or was it a... I think it was Ooh. a dog. It looked like a dog. At least to me it, it looked like a dog. I would say it, it's probably the dog you meet later on. But isn't that dog on the island? Why would it be here? Probably just some left, left alone well, To dog. be fair, it could also actually be something else. It That's could our be a first. Mountain, it could be a mountain lion. Or yeah, or like a, uh, like a uh, cougar. Mm. Yeah. A mountain lion. Here's our first hint. Ah, the ending. Mm -hmm. I like that that's the first hint that you get. It's actually the ending. <laughs> Explosion. Yeah, which makes you very wary, really, to go on the boat later because you saw that. Mm. Shimmy. Just needs some fresh sheets, some nice drapes, and six gallons of sanitizer. Basically, yeah. Six gal gallons would not would not make this house habitable. I you know what? I I think there's only one thing to do for this house. If you ask me, burn it. Te tear it down and build a new one. Yeah, burn it and build a new. But Seems surely like the best option. But as we talked about, he says, surely there must be a real murderer house. Somebody must have recreated it. Of course they have. Charlie, I'm getting an uneasy feeling about this. Somebody has a taxidermy hobby. Relax. <laughs> That's an awful taxidermy hobby, though. Look at that. That's not nicely made. This is spiking a lot of animals. That's all that is. I think you found his... His workshop. Yeah. This is also a scare, by the way, Norris, so... Oh. It will do things. That. What 
Fuck me. It is the first time you see the animatronics that you will see later. Mm -hmm. Look at that inside of his head. Yeah, batteries and all that. Fuck in hell. That's a lot of detail when you look at it. Mm. Of course, it's it's hard to make. It, he struggles with making the head sit nicely. Yeah. But it's torn open on the sides. Well, somebody has a slight hobby of taxidermy and a little bit more. Hmm. So what do you do in your spare time? Oh, you know, a bit of taxidermy, killing people. What? What? Uh, a little taxidermy. Uh, a little bit of, what's it called again? The... <laughs> and a slight bit of serial killing. I was not thinking he would go into the animatronics. Oh, yeah, a bit of animatronics. <laughs> oh... Ever so slight amount of mass merge. No, nothing big, nothing big. Mm, nothing big, nothing big. My favorite subject, or you just say, uh, my favorite subject is humans. It's perfect. Come on, get shooting. I want you to pan across the lake until the island comes into shot. Then zoom into that lighthouse. Look! It's all right. Come on. We better get back. I'm wondering how that uh, so our Dume imposter and his child, how they got murdered. Since we see them run, but then we see them dead later. Got him? him? I don't know. We just had the one call. H how did he know what our show was about in the first place? Uh, actually, I did not. That's weird. Let's just play nice, okay? Hello, Mr. Lonnet. That's me. I'm Grantham Dumet. Everyone climb aboard and we'll head out. This is Mark. Mark. Erin, Jamie. Ladies. And this is Kate. Pleased to meet you, Mr. Dumet. I'm looking forward to seeing all it is you have to offer. We truly appreciate this. Lovely to meet you all. What say we get underway? He seems so nervous. Again, I really mm. can't thank you enough for this opportunity. Of course. Was it your great uncle you said that... Um... Let's get to where we're going. I'll explain everything later. Sure. Of course. I mean, he has probably been told, like, get these people here. Or I'll kill your you daughter. Live. And I'll let you... And I'll let the two of you go. Mm-hmm. They aren't the first ones. Nope. And as we saw at the end, nor will they be the last ones. Nope. I wonder if you kill everyone, how different the ending will be. I mean, I would imagine they are normally quite brutal. Yeah, and the ending would mean that this place mm. still stands. Ah, oh, true. With more killing to do. Oh, there's one of the animatronics, right? Or is that him? I think that... No, that's him. That's not one of them. Because I think he has the plastic gloves. Let's get up to the hotel. Please, let's... Stay close. Stick together. Is it dangerous here? <laughs> yeah. No, of course not. You sure? Liar. Because you don't seem sure. It's perfectly safe. But we are a long ways from help if somebody gets hurt, so please... Take care. Looks like things have buttoned up tight around here. God. This way. Don't worry about your bags. I'll make sure they're brought. Is still gonna be nice this round? Next round, yeah. not so much. <laughs> next, <laughs> next time, I'm just gonna be a dick. Oh yeah, I'm gonna be a complete, full-on asshole. I'll be fine. Just pretend there's a carton of smokes at the top of the hill. You're right. He takes his security very seriously. But to be fair, what he's afraid will get in. Maybe hmm? you should be asking what he's trying not to let out. Jamie. Just saying. You watch too many horror movies. Is that all of them is just like everybody is fucking no, horrible no, people except perhaps one. <laughs> just go. I mean, he just said that she'd said, seen too many horror movies, but she's the one who actually calls out everything. Yeah, yeah. leading up to the house. Don't need the whole journey. Kate, talking to camera, then I'll direct you from there, okay? 
No photos. No recording of me at all. Is that clear? I'm Oops. a very private person. Don't worry, Mr. Dumas. Discretion is Lonnie and Liar. motto. You want the usual intro stuff, Charlie? Please. The light is good. I'm ready to go, Aaron. It sounds clear. Okay, let's go for a take then. Is Kate's face ready? Bitch, I'm always camera ready. Stop trying to make me like you. Rolling. Speed. And action. I've just arrived on the private island which claims to have genuine artifacts from H.H. H. Holmes' reign of terror. I'm heading to the house right now. Perfect, Kate. Now turn to face the house and start to walk. Okay, that's enough. And oh, gosh, they got him on really camera. Need to get going. Anything you say, Mr. Dumas? This way. You'll still see more shots, right? Obviously. <laughs> Obviously. Did very much that's one of the animatronics. Did it 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 I want to know what he's trying to hide. Just a murder house. What no biggie. Want to do? <laughs> he's cagey. Gee, maybe it's because the guy is fucking Seriously? horrified. It's just like... Come on, you are going to see somebody who loves AJ Holmes. What the fuck did you expect? What happened? You okay? Uh, did you grab your ego again? We should get her up to the hotel. Oh, I can barely move it. Jamie, stay with her. Why me? Because you know first aid. Remember how you patched her up? In Glendale? Oh, right. Okay. We'll find some ice and a bandage and come back. You have that at the hotel? Yes, sure. Then let's go. He's easily oh, talked around. Come on. I'll clue you in later. Been taking acting classes again? Yeah, yeah. What's Charlie want? A better lay of the land. And we're the scouts because I'm charming and you can hotwire your way past security. Come on. Up oh, top. Ah, the screwdriver of safety. <laughs> Who are the island? Um, I'll be right back, Eva. Yeah. Hey, can I ask you something and get a straight answer? You know, you know, you making a smart ass reply or taking a shot at me. That works both ways. Fine. Oh, tell me the truth. Is there any saving this show? Maybe. There's some sort of magical holy grail of footage or information to be had here. You think that's likely? No. <laughs> At best, we'll get some nice B-roll. That's not gonna save our asses. Mm -hmm. She'll have is a coin. Nice. He bowed. He likes to address people and keep them out. It's a bit of a scramble. Their running animations aren't very good, but yeah, we'll have to live with it. Yes, they weren't actually intended to run a lot. Please stop moving in front of me. Good, you, you can be up there. Let's... 
alarm system in you. Do we stretch and hydrate? Okay, we stretch and we hydrate. We got there. We stretch. Stretching is good. And hydrate. Why just standing around? There we go. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, but we're standing around because we were told to stretch and hydrate. You could have told us to dress for a trek. <laughs> they have good jumping skills, though. And then we have a little bit of a balancing act. Can you stop walking in front of me, please? Try not to fall and die. I don't want to see Mark cry. Thanks for the concern. Really. Bad running. Very good at jumping, really. Bench. Crash cam. Ruined picture. Oh, she doesn't actually have a light. I wonder where this goes. Oh. Straight up and down the hill. Yeah. But what's on the other end? A hotel? Really, there's nothing else inside here? There is not. You go. You go. Oh, this is where I actually failed at hiding last time. I'm gonna see if we can do it better this time. And I'm back. My Welcome wife. back. Aha. Uh -huh. She died. Oh, shit. Sorry, I didn't mean to be rude. Come on, we're about there. They didn't see us. Let's go. <laughs> they didn't see us just standing, <laughs> standing in their <laughs> street in front of their face like they didn't see us. <laughs> okay then. Well they would definitely have heard us. I don't know Miss Blabbermouth. Now I am curious if they're gonna follow continue Holy shit, continue holy, I can't pronounce that word. Continuation? Yeah, no, the continue. Like, blah, blah, blah. Continuity. Thank you. You're I couldn't welcome. say. I couldn't say. That, I, can't, I still can't say the word. Continuity. Continuity. Thank Here we you. Go. Uh, of that, she hurt her foot. If she is not being helped, maybe this is the way. Yeah. To, like, try to walk. I will be annoyed. <laughs> to be to be to be frank, that's a hard word. Yes, yes, it is. I mean, true, it's a hard word, but I oh. would like to believe that I'm at least fluent in English. Yeah, but it's not sometimes that bad. your brain just stops. Mm. Isn't that a lovely... Uh, Jesus! Ah. Uh, is, that a, is it a weasel or squirrel? I think... I, I, I'd say weasel. I think it's a weasel. Yeah. Now, where is... Yeah, it is a weasel. Now, where is the baboon? Hmm, now that is the important question. I do not see it anywhere. Perhaps we will find it later. <laughs> I mean, there might be a baboon in a room somewhere. I, heard I mean, it could be a place. funny Easter egg. Yeah. I'm not sure I can afford the rent on this one. Wonderful natural light, though. And that's our Dumay, I think. Mediterranean Cruise 21. Like has a family. But I, I'm pretty sure this isn't the May, but it's uh, the Morellos. Yeah, Morello. 
Yeah, Morello, his what? wife and his daughter. Yeah. I wonder... Uh, so I'm pretty sure that the dude actually threatened them to say that if you don't yeah. do this, I'll take your I, daughter. I, I've already killed... I've killed your wife. Yeah, I'll do the yeah. same with your daughter. Mm. And down here we have a bird spotting. A spotter's guide to birds on the British Isles. And here we have another hint of doom. Yeah, that's what happens if somebody dies, apparently. Yeah, that was that was a that was uh, Aaron's body. Correct. That is Aaron if we kill, when you kill her and they find her later. That's uh, the streamer I watched playing this the first time. He he did that. He managed mm. to kill Aaron in the first room. Oh. So, yeah, she died quickly. <laughs> That's where I found out. The way I think about it, because I know the story of Holmes, I am uh, an avid fan of true crime. Mm. So I read a lot, I've checked a lot. My first instinct wasn't to attack when he attacked me, it was to take what he was giving me. Mm. Because they always like to play play games. Mm. And having a victim that having an asthma attack is not fun for them to... Enough no, for them. I mean, serial killers or killers in general would like to like be the one who is the cause. Yeah, do the deed. A asthma and stuff like that, I mean, that's like, oh, you're stealing my fucking fun. Yeah. And in a way, it's a brilliant way to both scare the shit out of her and make mm. her story sound highly unlikely for everyone that's listening. So I was very much like, nah, I'm gonna take that because if I don't, I think he's gonna kill me. There's a question though that we might have to try for fun when we do the kill all. I mean, I would imagine that... Because you can that, attack that, with that her. Is a, that, yeah, but that, I, I imagine that would be insta-kill. Uh, what I think I remember from what the said streamer did was that he tried once to to stab Mr. Mr. Holmes. Yes. And I, I mean, I hope that whoever is watching you is just joining in for the first time because then you are like telling the plot. Yes, but this is it says that it's a second playthrough, so. Oh. Um... It says round I can two. see now, Isa, that some of the coins that you're finding again, like the same coin, mm, they still count. Are only, are only worth one. Yeah, but that's because they're the, the gray and the dark ones. It's the gold and the higher ones that actually mm. suddenly gave me more. <laughs> okay. So when you told me that uh, 220 was like the max, is that so you can buy like everything? Probably, but I saw an achievement for 200 coins. Hmm. It could be really cool, like, if in the distance, if you look like that, could be, like, an easter egg of him, like, just fucking following you, like... If yeah. You if you turned at like... certain places, you would see him in the yellow coat there, walk behind. That would be so cool. Mm -hmm. Very creepy, but also cool. You see, that's the thing. And, I, again, fun thing coming from the coward here. But that's, to me, that would be, like, that would really, like... You said we stood freak. here. Oops, here. And suddenly you saw, like, something yellow... Just moving yeah, in the bushes yeah, over there. For, for a brief second, just or, move past it. And I'm just go gonna, like, what? Yeah, if you see... If I move... There. Mm. A little gap there. Mm. If you suddenly moved across there, and you pan there, it's like, whoa! <laughs> Hello? Yeah. What the fuck was that? What? Who or what was that? And normally, that is where I would freak the fuck out. <laughs> but it makes for a good horror. Um. I, uh, again... I mean, I have no problem with horror. Horror is supposed to scare you. Again, I am a very fucking easy target of it. Yes. But, again, I respect and love horror exactly. when it's done well. Because I've seen a lot of bad horror movies, and that's where it's like, when they say, oh, well, you didn't find this one to be scary. Because, because it wasn't it's scary. Bad. It's bad. It's bad. And when things are bad, then it's not scary. When it's well put together... Shit, it's scary, yo. Yeah, especially if it lets your mind decide mm. what's supposed to be scary, because that's what's scary. Mm. Um, a few mates of 
of mine uh, and I were actually in to see the new horror movie Smile. Oh, is it good? I mean, I I mean, my friend who is also like really love um, horrors says that it was one of the best horror movies he had seen in a while. Nice, nice. I mean, to me, it was still like pretty fucking scary, <laughs> but. As as uh, he when he said that he if I want to go in and see a horror I saw the trailer first, and the thing about horror in general like when it's become like um how can I, how can I say it when it becomes very supernaturally oh yeah based it's not as scary to me as when it's like fucking real life thing oh yeah I know I know no because I, I can always because then I can always convince my brain you know what it's fiction it's fiction it's complete fiction look. Yeah, it's fiction. That that's but, but that's generally with me and me, mm. me and Dre as well. It's it's always that, just that it's fiction. Jamie, mm. can you fix yeah, this? and that's normally not what I can do, but but still, it's good and yeah, but nice. Gotta go. No way. No, I don't think... you have? Don't oh. you have you... to start on the top now? Yeah, it's the top. I have puzzle. On... I might remember the later puzzle. I think. <laughs> Maybe. I just started doing things wrong. Imagine just taking that shit all the way to the top. <laughs> For a brief fucking moment, I thought there was someone behind them. Yeah, it would have been so. That would also been a brilliant moment to have somebody standing. Yeah, uh, it was similarly the wood near the gate. That's for a brief moment, my brain said, "That's a person." Exactly. That's what makes uh, gifts the creeps. Mm. And up we go. And hello, dragon. How are you doing? Up we I, go. I would. I mean, scary games for me is all about the ambience, as you have seen when we play Phasmophobia. Yeah. It's not like the. Again, the ghost. Do I scream? Yes. Do I scream like a bitch? Yes. yes. But it's the ambience that here. really fuck bugs me. Hear that? Ooh, see? They could have, have used that a bit more, really. Oh, we were seen. It's the wrong place to hide. Oh well. I'm good too. Wonder who you are. I keep not understanding. So we should actually just hide behind this. Huh. Oh well. Not gonna be a perfect, perfect run, but as long as nobody dies, we're good. Makes you wonder though. It's in here. I mean, it's, I know it's locked. I wonder what these are. That's the question. This is shiny. It's so shiny. Yeah, that's the heel to the shoe. It makes you wonder. We found a shoe earlier, and this is the heel. Hmm. Makes me wonder if they were trying to escape. I mean, they probably were. The woman in the cabin we saw. Yeah. She didn't have any thing on her feet, so. Could be her shoes. Yeah, or and in that picture of, of the summer vacation, she didn't she wear shoes? Yeah. Or like stilettos there? Like I'm here. Oh. Oh god, that's so much better. I guess I just needed to rest it for a minute. I think I'm okay. They found a shortcut up the hill. I really need you to stay where I say. You got it, Mr. Gumet. We're all here now. Let's head on. Everyone stay under the watchful eye of Mr. Dumet, please. Kate. What do you think? A summer camp from hell. Yes, what she's not it? wrong. We're gonna find out what's up his sleeve before too long. Don't worry about that. 
Oh, you are. And again, you are here. Here in the, again in that scene where you see something in the background, mm. you could like say, okay, why are you showing me this? Coming or what? Uh -huh. Clearly, exactly. like you could just show that You're he's lurking hurts? or something else, mm -hmm. like just something yellow, a little hint yeah. of yellow, because you look for the yellow coat. That's so mean. Just go. <laughs> oh my god, relax, Mark. Ooh, that serious drop. You good? Oh man. We're still gonna be nice this time. Should yeah. we do a cherry one? Just to see? Mm. Ah, let's offer a piggyback ride. Why a piggyback ride? Don't be an asshole. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, sorry. Remember what your therapist friend said? That belittling your neuroses is not an effective strategy to help you overcome them. I know. I'm saying I'm sorry. Thank you. Here, give me your hand. That's it. However, it doesn't seem very afraid of heist later, to be honest. Don't look down. Yeah, <laughs> sorry. So here's the thing, are they a couple? Because I have not they completely... Were. Oh, they were. They've been broken up very recently, apparently. Ah, okay. So I take it when they all survive, you blah, blah, blah. They go back to together again and... Yes, they never know. Should catch up hmm. to Mr. But if you play, play it right, they get a lot closer again, at least. Where is everyone? Apologies, uh, they're all city folk. Come on, let's go. We're losing the day, people. You just go get this five there we has it. I mean they have built a very good replica though. It does look a lot like the building we saw earlier in the game. Mm -hmm. This wow. Mr. Dumet, this place is magnificent. Yeah. Maybe this won't be a waste of a weekend. Oh, it will be. <laughs> well, I mean, if you come out alive, perhaps not, but... Uh, oh, here's uh, his little girl. Hello. I wonder who you are. What are you doing? I, I saw a little girl. Up there. Up there. Maybe it's your one fan. And now she's lost forever. You are such a dick. Everything in here is... Let's see. Timothy's scared about her fame. Bitter rivals. Yeah. Oh, so Mr. you lost one? You missed something there. It seems like we missed something. Maybe because we were spotted. Oh, probably. It's fragile, please be careful. Because I'm a scrub. Okay, clearly the man is fucking panicking. I mean, no, 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 but he seems terrified, right? Whoa. Yeah. I mean, I would Look fucking say something. It's amazing. This is intense. Would you all mind signing in at the, the fact time? that they make them sign in? Uh, hmm. This isn't everything. I'm sure the rest is almost here. I'll, I'll make sure it gets to your rooms. Kate's makeup case is slowing it down. Erin, cigarettes. Blue backpack. Settle in, and I'll meet you all at dinner. At eight. Mr. Dumas, I cannot say thank you enough times. This is truly fantastic. I told you all this was a good plan, didn't I? The fact that the number on that wall keeps changing. Now it's uh, one no, zero one seven eight. Mm. It will change several times.
Oh yeah, this is nice. I remember this old See, lady. now that I know what that is... Yeah. That is fucking disturbing. I know, right? Oh, there you are. Busy, busy, busy. You've been out and about all day. And I have to sit here worrying. God, all day and not a Maybe it's a clock? No, we don't you. think so. When you see him from this way, it's very cleverly done because you just think yeah. it's his grandmother who's, or mother who's really angry with him. <laughs> yeah, it's just talking. And you see it on the other end later, it's not that fun. Hello, Erin. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. You're jumpy. Oh my god. I think I peed a little. How did you not hear me coming? I was... I don't think we're the only ones here. Kate saw a little girl looking out a window at us when we were outside. That's who I saw. A little girl. Mr. Demet probably has family, a staff, maybe friends. Who knows? That said, this place does give me the willies. It's, um... It's unique. Are you singing? Oh, yeah, that's my being scared song. This is my don't be scared song. Sing it and I won't be scared long. <laughs> Doesn't really work. I bet. 181. Uh, I think I'm around the corner. 183? This is me. Okay. Okay. Good luck out there. Don't get lost. <clears throat> Invite her in. Scream if you need me for mm -hmm. anything. Thanks. I got you. Nothing to be scared of. Actually, hey. Yeah? Why don't you hang a second while I unpack, then I can help you find your room? Something about this place makes me want to use the buddy system. Yes. Thanks. I don't She's know. the one who reads into the red flags the most. The mm. Jamie. I mean, to be fair, in, in the normal horror troupe, trope with like and people of color is immediately like oh. well they're first gonna die wait a minute cozy in your playthrough she was the one who died i know but she it wasn't that wasn't you the way the trope. i know if we had to so... like last time we've married by morning you talk in your sleep not sure i ever told you that sure what did i say actually it was just a bunch of incoherent swearing oh I was awake. I was reading Kate's social media posts. Ugh, that bitch. Okay, don't hate me, but she's been kind of nice to me. I mean, I think she's more upset about Mark than she lets on. Lies. She's a robot. Uh, where's the bathroom? Wait, what? Hotel, Old baby school. hotel. Ah, uh, gross school. What do I have to pee in the middle of the night? Am I gonna walk in on Charlie sitting on the pot? Guess that means there's no mini bar either. Oh. Shows what you know. What is that? Wine, genius. Oh, I feel like if we start drinking, Charlie will find out and lecture me and make me feel like an asshole again. Yeah, he does that. But we're not on the clock. Not until we're rigging to shoot. Which is hard to do drunk. <laughs> I'm not suggesting we get full on hammered before we work. Why are you doing that? I'm thirsty. Also, you're cute when you're worked up. I don't... cute? You think <laughs> I'm cute? Hmm? Oh. Got a stick on my own if you want to share a lip cooties. Oh, thanks, but I can find mine. Just to tell us that she has asthma, very basically. <laughs> okay, so don't stare at a woman looking for her inhaler. Let's all pat the dust first. <laughs> Lip goodies, yes. You trying to scare me now? No. Revenge, cause good job. I just need to point something out here. Mm -hmm. 
I mean, you sure you're okay? Because uh, yeah, I know. I'm Again, really have asthma. Mm. I have never seen mm. asthma being activated that quick. No, but like I say, illness is never correctly portrayed in in like TV series and shit mostly. No, the, the reason also, I guess also it's just like a pet peeve. But it's because, for example, I am very, I'm hyper allergic to cat. Mm. You sure? Sure. And again, it's not the I'm cat, sure. it's the things that all the fucking so, small uh, parasites there yeah. is, that lives in their claws. The claws? So if I don't take medicine, yeah, I like the bacteria that is on, they have a special oh. form of bacteria on, uh, underneath that? their claws. Oh. And, and now you're poisoned. It's not that bad. You're not lying. It's, um, it's <laughs> that, for example, if I don't it's take my medicine and I get scratched, sure. I know, for example, I have... In general, like, 30 minutes, 15 to 30 minutes, and then I need to take my medication, because if I don't, uh, yeah, things go, go badly. really bad. Yeah. I, wanna say a strong I mean, she just said that she was allergic to dust, and then she put the dusty bottle to her mouth. <laughs> Logic. You are such a liar. You're flirting. Oh, sorry. I thought you meant the thinking you were cute thing. Really? Um, if my cheeks are red, it's from this wine, not because I am bashful. I swear. Really. Sorry. Didn't mean to make you feel weird. I, I yeah, it's just we work together and Charlie is always on me about being more professional and I get it. No, I mean I, I'm not saying I don't appreciate it. Er, er. Or that I don't think you're cute, too. It's just, um... Oh. Let's just do it. More awkwardness. Bring it on. What are you doing? I, oh my god, I, uh... I... <laughs> oh, you bitch! <laughs> I'm just fucking with you. I wanted to kiss you for months. I just was scared to make a real move. Kissy kissies. And we fell out of the bed. Sorry. Who is that? Well, there's a multitude of options. Domino's. <laughs> that would be fun. Domino's pizza. Or Charlie. Enjoying yourself out here like some sort of pervert? Sorry, did I uh, interrupt something here? No, we're just talking shop. We're worried about the power grid handling all of our gear. Yeah, yes. If this place is running on a generator, we need to know what it's putting out. I don't care what you guys are doing. Then why are you lurking? I can't find my room, and I need a fucking cigarette. <laughs> These funny shapes? Our numbers, the cigarette hump. they go up and down in order. Thank you. I've just been down there. Look, give me ten, then we should get a rough plan for getting our first shot. We have all evening. Can't we plan after dinner? Nope. I'd like to chill for a minute after the trek getting here. I want to be shooting after dinner. You've got ten minutes. Okay, uh, whoa, the, the lip okay. movement there mm -hmm. was we'll not good. No. There's a lot of face jankiness. Oh, Erin, I checked my blue. I mean that that no again. That's what happens. That's again, it's come and show me. As you long as the history is good, yeah. but it's just like it's nitpicking. It is, but it's a bit funny anyway. To be continued. Yes, definitely. Definitely to be continued. Good luck finding I just don't rooms. kill all of you instead. <laughs> Whoa! Well, that's just not this wrong, preferably. No, but didn't you see the door? Yes, I saw the door. <laughs> Look at them running, though. Come on, come on, let's go, let's go. That's why it's a bit surprising to find them, you know, later. Where the hell are they going? Away from this hell house.
which is where you should go too. Mm hmm. We know there's somebody behind that mirror. That's such foreshadowing, though. I also want to point out the fucking guy has, has had plastic gloves on for that long. His skin must be irritated. I can almost bet you that he has uh, what? powder under. Because you only see him with gloves at all times. A good way not to leave any fingerprints. And that's just creepy. Charlie. Charlie's bedroom. Well, I'm looking. Oh, Kate wanted you to have this. Breaking down walls, navigating the maze of anxiety. Are you fucking kidding me? I think she thought it might help with your stress. Or... Absolutely not. I'm not stressed. Okay? Ah, the saving book for later. Do I look fucking stressed? Yes. Uh... That was rhetorical. Well, your cards came out nice enough. Oh, yeah. Embossing makes a huge difference. You old guys love business cards. <laughs> old school. You old school guys. I also put it on heavy stock and did the logo in foil. Damn. I should have had one ready for Mr. Yes, Dick. Yes, you should have. Did you find them? I... No. I swear I put them in here. I don't understand. <sighs> Jesus. We're still gonna be Look, stop tearing around in there like a maniac. Be organized about it. Methodical. Blue bag, front pocket. I made a specific mental note of it. They're gone, Charlie. Gone? Just like that? Yep. Are you saying somebody took them? Yep. I I don't actually I can see Kate doing that. Or Jamie. I'm sorry. Well, let's just get it's on fine. With you. Let's just get on with things. This place is massive. <laughs> Determined. Surely there is a pack of cigarettes in here somewhere. Can you imagine Did how you unstable he's going to be if we go the other way with everything? There must be cigarettes hmm. in the bar, right? I mean, technically, it's not legal to smoke in bars, so. Come on, we're checking. If you find them first, all will be forgiven. <laughs> all will be forgiven. You fucking dick. Yeah. Well, I guess bar. check out the room to see if you if there's a coin somewhere. Okay, so he has a spare cap. What's weird about that? There's plenty weird about that, Charlie. Mm, creepy mirror, creepy mirror. Hmm. Doesn't seem to be anything in in here. Yeah. Where did we throw the book? I just want to see if he wants to have a look I think at it. the book has already... I mean, I think... The scope of this place is... I can't oh. believe we've looked into this. I mean, he... F Are you worried it will make... They, he, he, he must have thrown it that way and then the wall moved. Can't be helped. Yeah, probably. This will be the one that people remember. The one that wins an Emmy? Exactly, that's the... Scope. Oh, there it is. All the way Stick up there. Me, Aaron. I'm going. Jesus Christ, how fucking hard did he throw it? We'll get another season. Worry, very, very right. far. I'll stick to making sure that my life runs smoothly and I'll make sure you keep working. Sound good? Uh, sure. He just put it down. I think if we get past the book with another character, let's see if we can pick it up, pick it up with several no, characters. No, don't you, uh, don't you remember? Yeah, when, I know it uh... does something, but I also think it's gonna get put back. Hmm. But we don't know. But it would be interesting to try. True. Maybe for the fuck up everything run. Mm -hmm. Leave it for that. No. Like, why are all these rooms locked? And this feels like, yeah. Oh. Oh, hello. Business card. Architect. Oh, we found them all. That's the one I lacked from the first run. Hmm. And if you, all his business cards say that he is the same things that 
Mr. Holmes says in the beginning. Builder, architect. Hmm. Doctor. Doctor. Hello, coin. You've got to be worth something. To the ferryman, yes, I'm sure it is. But yeah, it's a. Uh, I like the idea of them using, like, even that he's used, that he has business cards that tell you everything that H.H. Mm. Holmes always said that he was. So these paintings are very random. This one, I mean, if you if you need to fill out a, uh, a, a hotel... Yeah. Start quote, end quote. Um... I don't think you really give a shit about what fucking no. paintings you get. That, that's also it, because you see the same pictures several times. Oh, mm -hmm. oh. Shiny. So shiny. Mr. Grantham Dumet. 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 Joseph Morello. Mr. Morello, good evening. Thank you for following, no, allowing me to contact you directly. Your publisher said that you were very keen to hear from me. It seems we have mutual interests. I have spent several years constructing the ultimate Holmes tourist experience by faithfully recreating the World's Fair Hotel. Lovely. <clears throat> we have not yet opened to public as there is some finishing touches to complete, and I consider a man of your knowledge could provide insight that is valuable before our official opening. Therefore, I invite you to visit the hotel for the weekend. No, thank you. I mean, there's a red light there. Faithfully recreating the World's Fair <laughs> yeah but i think it's like mm -hmm. but again uh, what another thing that like let's... wait and two girls to join me yeah wife and two girls to join me my brother francis in town and oh yeah there's a little girl crying as well isn't there it was already dead yeah so he's lost one one child and his wife. Lovely. Yeah, that's true. Oh, sh oh, fuck. That makes it even worse now. Yeah. Nice day he had at the hotel. <laughs> mm. Mm. Not really. Wait, uh, do we see the date, actually? Oh, let's, let's do Because today, when you started with Charlie, it's the 26th. Yeah, this is the 14th. Of yeah, and... And he replies on the 15th, and mm -hmm. then he says a week, so... Just before us, though. Yeah, I think it, it says it, in the book week. downstairs. Oh, yeah. I mean, that makes sense. So, a week before. Mm -hmm. Fuck. It takes about... It doesn't take that long to clean up a mess, I guess. No, no, but I'm just, like, trying to figure out how many fucking people has that fucker then killed. Too many. That... Karen, what you already do for this company is very valuable to us. Carrying your bag. Still 0178. Absolutely. To get ahead in this industry, you have to pay your dues. Show you're ready to muck in. I. Did you do that? Nah, I, I bought it. Get an, assistant. Mm -hmm. an assistant. Oh, it was just a stupid idea, Charlie. I'm an just. An assistant. He likes it. A slave. A personal assistant. Sort of. And then I could help out with the editing. Pardon me? The editing? The audio mix. Look, I just think you've got so much to give, so much experience. Same and it's an opportunity to pass again. that knowledge on. Right. And again. Yes, I suppose it is. And an assistant wouldn't lose my cigarettes, would they? Exactly. Nothing is to pick so, up on. Um... Do you still want to direct movies, Charlie? I am directing. No, but I mean real movies. With a big budget and big stars. Erin, there's something important that you have to understand. In the work that we do, the very important work, the truth is the star. <laughs> oh, right. Yeah, sorry, Charlie. So you don't want to direct movies. Can we move on from this? I suppose I should be saying... We're, like, just my locked in with the... And not our oh. gear. Later okay, but for now, just stop. There we go. The thing that ticked me off here very quickly is look at the check-in and the check-out. 
they've not checked themselves out. Somebody else checking them out. Because the writing is completely different. So we have Brad Fisher, Rachel Davis, Jackie mm -hmm. Fiddles, Scott Thorne, Grace Fletcher. They're, they came here in, this, in September and left again in October. Right. Hello. Hello. The, who is the, hello. Thomas Hall, Cecile Hall and Kurt Hall also supposedly left. Eight days after they came there. <laughs> no. See, here's the thing also. Isn't it... You... One would imagine that you would, like, notice the fact that the check-in handwriting mm. is very different from the check-out it's writing. It's completely different. And there you have them. Joseph Morello, Michelle Morello, Francis and Natalie and Bethany Morello. Mm. And we, of course, have us. We have not been signed out yet. Mm. Maybe if we, yes. if we kill everyone in in the in the next run, I would imagine that all of your checkouts. Would exactly. Be... What if it pans into this book and we've checked out? Ah, oh, that would be quite. Cool. Wouldn't make sense. Would Have you had a good cool. day, sis? Yeah, and complain. What's productive? Mm -hmm. I was doing Isis new emotes. Us. Sweet. We have some new ones, but I'm waiting for certain ones that I want to make sure that I have before I put in the rest. Since I'm still waiting to get the free the free emote. Mm -hmm. All the shiny emotes. Because I think I need to be streaming for 60 days or something, which I don't think I'm close that close to you yet. Hello. Hard. Thank you for choosing Twilight Prairie's residence for your mother. Lucinda is already settling in well. This is to Mr. Hector Monday. 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 Most looks very good tree from Venus Dois. Hmm. Oh, thank you, Venus Dois. Still debating if I move the two first one to tier two and tier three and use the the, the the big cat of it holding a heart for subs <laughs> instead. Because, I mean, who's crazy enough to use tier 3? Tier 2, for that matter. So, what about you, Nor? Have you had a nice day? Hey, I've had an okay call. day, to be honest. You just ask him I have cigarettes. two weeks uh, work. Um, weeks of work left. And then, um, yeah, on to new adventures, I take it. Uh, but everything is good. Just checked uh, regarding the new Sea of Thieves patch. Um, apparently, because they are changing a few things. Apparently, it should fix uh, certain uh, PvP aspects. Like, okay, listen, we are gonna try and make it so ding, ding. for for most people, we can do so. You go strictly PvP, and you don't piss off everybody. Huh. No, Aww. like there's no red flag that there was no key there earlier, right? Mm. And Jackpot. now suddenly the key Ellie, we don't need is there. The <laughs> After Mystery somebody key. rings the bell. Maybe. By the way, has he written? Has he written anything in the book? In the book? Yeah. Yeah, we've written our names. Yeah, but I'm talking about. Do you think that he also just like quickly wrote something in the book? Let's find out. Doesn't look like it. Nah, I mean, if it's nope. if it... nothing, I guess the only signs people out after they're dead, yeah, after they after he's sure they're dead, Th then they then they're then they're signed out. Good job, he runs like a clown, he looks like a clown when he's running. Why don't I go check for a gift shop or something? I've already had one asthma attack today, gift and this shop. dust farm is exactly what I don't need. A gift shop might have cigarettes. Exactly. Had a girl. Hello. I need, I need the pizza mode, you know. Oh. Uh, to... It's in the works. I know. I know. Hello. Well, that that's a premonition. 
Which Hot one is it? Hot oh yes, burn, baby burn. You're gonna enjoy that later, Charlie. Trust me. <laughs> not, burn, not, not baby today. burn. Not today, but he's gonna be toasty. He's toasty, gonna be very toasty, toasty. princess. Now, which movie is that from? I have no idea. <sighs> it is from Lion King, I think, too. Mm. Good morning to you all. I'm Chester Bell, Assistant Director at the Federal Bureau of Investigation. At approximately 0530 local time, a team led by Special Agent Hector Monday and supported by law enforcement officers conducted a raid of a motel room just outside Birmingham, Alabama to apprehend Manny Sherman, the man known as the Beast of Arkansas. Using state-of-the-art psychological profiling techniques, Special Agent Monday and members of his task force not only identified their suspect, but predicted his movement with unerring accuracy. I'm delighted to say we have our man. Killer of the, the nasty killer of doom. Wonder if that's a real one. A real. I don't remember a butcher from Arkansas. I mean, that might be just fiction, you know. Yeah. Then again, it is the United States. There are plenty of fucking people. Yeah, I mean, it's one of the best comments in a TV, in a TV series that I watched about serial killers, which I do believe is fairly correct. Uh, the mind mind hunter. Yeah, the mind hunter. Uh, what where... was the guy called? The beast of Arkansas. The beast of Arkansas. Yeah, the beast of Arkansas. To YouTube. <laughs> to YouTube. To Google or YouTube to check if it's real. The beast of Arkansas. Miss Kelly Schroeder. I read this in the first one, so I'm not gonna read all of it again. I'm sorry. My voice will go away if I try. <laughs> Aww. Also, Isa? Yeah? It was not very polite to win in handball. <laughs> that was a weird game. It was a really weird fucking game. You were in the lead for 55 minutes and then you got the jitters. I, I don't know how yeah. else to explain wow. it. I mean... Well, it huh. I, I, I mean... Mr. Dumet, sir. <laughs> I actually felt kind of sorry for them. Please. A packet of cigarettes, please. Hello? Nobody's home. No, unfortunately, Hello? cannot find a packet of smoke. <laughs> any reports on Beast of Arkansas. Mm. There's a folk, folk moss monster mm. Thank you, in Arkansas Bob. folklore. Sir, sir, whatever you wish. Uh, <laughs> and the Beast no of Boggy well. Creek. <laughs> oh, it's the same thing. Thank you very much. Never mind. Mechanical friend. That's about it. Much appreciated. Oh, yeah. and the white white river monster. Ooh. <sighs> yeah, that, that handball game was something very different. Than what I expected it to be. We that were like it. behind for so long. Hmm. I mean Akieta. See it this way, I would say the Norwegian team, I mean, you have a lot of experience, they are older. The Danish team is quite young, so I think that's why the Jitters came. Yeah, it was your first chance in eight 14 years. years. Oh, 14 years. Yeah. It was eight years, you you broke an eight year loss record yes. earlier. Mm. And then yes. it was 14 years to beat us in the championship. But, I mean... it. It, it feels like it was a, a case of the jitters. Damn it! But again, it was a still congratulations on winning. Thank you. You did. I mean, that was a very good, uh, a promising way of getting it. But then your mm. team is heading in the right direction finally. Hmm. It, it has been a while. Yeah, it's weird too because you were always so up there before. I mean, um, isn't there normally just like peaks and valleys? Yeah. In general? It is. I mean, I know for a fact there's a lot of 
uh, people talking about that Norway's football team is about is on the rise now. I heard your dad rumor, but we'll see. We'll see. I mean, for fuck's sake, Denmark has been like. I did not nearly shit my pants because of that. <laughs> I'm sorry. Heads up would have been nice. I'm sorry, I forgot. I, mostly because I I didn't find that scary at all, so it didn't really hit me that it could be. I, oh, I, I am my so apologies. happy for you. Yes. Look at the man wanting his cigarettes. Oh, daddy. Oh, daddy. Come to daddy and the cigarettes go now. No point. Oh no, 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 please, come on, no. Uh, no. The horrors of being a smoker without your cigarette. The true horror of the horror game. The worst part is when I saw him like punching, I wanted to say, finish him. <laughs> finish the machine. <gasps> Hope is back. <laughs> Thank you, Lord. Ha! R zero zero twenty eight. He's gonna get you. Oh, come on, you piece of shit. Don't do this to me. <sighs> Antique rubbish. Give them to me. Give me my cigarettes. That they do right. The way he just walks almost up to him like this. I'm gonna go and get my key grip, and they are gonna kick the shit out of you. Hey, Charlie. And gone. Yeah. I'm still in the bar. I think it's dinner time. We should get everyone else. Okay, I'm coming. And I'm coming back. Yeah, this dinner, this dinner meeting can also be a right shit are you show. Alone in there? Who's that behind the bar? What? Is he never gonna acknowledge that the mannequin is constantly moving? Well, it's an uh, animatronic. He's already acknowledged that. Hello, Mr. Cameraman. Hey, I had a thought on an intro segment. You wanna shoot now? Yeah, if we get it shot and in the bank, maybe Charlie will stop rewriting everything I come up with. Yeah. <laughs> okay, sure. What? Nothing. Just give me a sec, and I'll be good to go. I'm supposed to buy nothing is eating away at you? Yes. How many times have you cleaned that lens? I'm just prepping my gear. Really? Yeah. Always focusing on the detail, Mark. What about taking a huge risk and just do something? I watched you fuss for a whole week before you turned down that job offer, all because you had to take one extra train to get there. The job wasn't the right move. The train thing confirmed it. Flimsy. I don't buy it. You don't have to buy it. Come on, let's just shoot this. Let's use natural light so we can do it alone. Didn't the lobby have starlight? I don't remember. I just want to look decent. You look good in any light. I'm not worried. Are you trying to butter me up? Yes. Is it working? Marginally. I'll take it. Mark. Why are you letting them all think I broke up with you? I feel like if Jamie knew the truth, you might back off. I mean, they all just assumed. I can't decide if that's sweet or selfish, or both. We're hitting the golden hour. We should be able to find a good spot. <laughs> I don't know why you camera dorks call it that. It's 15 minutes at best. Yes and no, if you have the right reflector. 15 minutes. <laughs> At the most. <laughs> Look, let's go find some light and get started. Thanks for, for making it. friends with Kate. Well, we Next time we will not make friends sure with anyone. Selfie angle. By Why the way, am I the sure? only one who noticed that Mark's clothes reminds me of like the the clothes you have uh, the on and the, the first angle. Assassin's Creed game? It does there. remind me a little of that. It does. Yeah. <laughs> but does he have the Assassin's <laughs> Creed talent? You like it? He does not. Find a hail bale. crash. Short term lease, so I can take my time to find something I really like. That is still the funniest thing so I've ever seen in the Witcher game. So we can take a picture of ourselves. Awesome. So I got out. 
Or the wall in front of us, yes. Um, just out of curiosity, did you have you two ever played The Witcher 2? No. Uh, no, I saw Todd playing it. The, the funniest thing is that in one of the first, or in like the prologue mission, I think it is, you can find um, where you like siege a castle and all that. You can find a hay bale and a guy just dead in the hay. So it's like, so, ah, since we can't do it idiot tomorrow, probably tried to jump from. This weekend, okay, to come and get my stuff. Oh, hello. From the good time, Chicago, 19. Ah, oh, that's them. Oh, how very sweet. Yes, super, super sweet. <laughs> What's that thought I heard? It did may have happen. Shit happens. Hello, Ford. He can't hear you. <laughs> no shit. I would have been scared if he replied. That would be you know, like the ultimate jump scare. Random <laughs> thought enters the screen. Just checking if there's something. If it turns green, we take a picture. So I'm just going to check if there's anything in the room we should be taking a picture of. Oh, fuck that hurt. What did you do? Uh, he needs his desk more probably. Yeah. yeah. Why? I, put, <laughs> I tried to put one leg over the other and uh, use a bit too much force to slam it right up my desk. Okay, let's see. I want to test something. And right in the... What I like to call the... Um, The retard picture. spot where you're like you're you get like that knee jerk reaction. Yeah. There. Ah, you mean that part where the doctor hit you with a hammer to get to see if you have a reflex? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So yeah. There is a really uh, mm. really funny place to be hit. This is like me checking if we can take pictures of anything. Have Ooh. picture proof. There is a shiny over there. I know. I'm just going to check over here. Just... You know, just in case. Because we don't want to miss a thing. Oop. Whoa, there, Bucko. I was just checking for a light. Remember our talk about boundaries? I need my room to be my private, safe place. Oh, come on. Sometimes I'm glad we went to therapy. Other times, it makes for some weird-ass rules. <laughs> this place does have a little bit of water damage like over there. Look at that. That looks like water damage to me. And that looks like a death trap. Well, a death omen. I'm not sure if I found that one last time. I think I did. Some of the premonitions you don't really know if it's actually trying to tell you something or not. Who has pictures like that that I will tell? Apparently, this person. Oh, look at this. Hello. Nothing spooky about There's this, right? Back here. Oof. Perfectly normal to have like this kind of a room in a hotel. Sure. Sandra, can we take a picture? Ah, oh, why would it become so blurry? Bad camera equipment. <laughs> On barbs. I mean, this should be a nice so place if to. So, catches us in here, are we breaking one of his rules? 
He did say not to go wandering. And we did practically bust the door down and get in here. We? Hello. So maybe we should take care. Probably. The groundskeeper. Yeah, I feel like Dumet is a kind of... Ding dong. Shit. Groundskeeper Willy? That's <laughs> kind the fuck out of me. Really? A clock? Yeah. Scared the hell out of you? Apparently so. What a weenie. Me? No. no. Yeah. Oh, hello. Well, we got the picture of whatever that was. I mean, it has to be something. Let's see the, the devil, Joseph Morello. <laughs> Whoa, my brain completely. <laughs> Why did you do it that way? Man. Nah, seen it. Let's see the devil, the truth behind the first Amer America's first serial killer. So he has two books. All of you to assume the devil is a he. Well, it depends on which devil it is. I'm sure it can be both a he and she. Or it. If it so wishes. I would imagine the devil don't really give a shit. Exactly. It will just be whatever it feels like. Whatever fits the best. Mm. Whatever fits the narrative. This takes me back. That's more than just like scratching the shit out of your sure. desk. Rebel. That's basically leaving your desk. Come on. <laughs> I was about to say, I carved in my desk. That is a definite not carved. That is what appears to be an axe. Mm. My good sir. This red light is like the worst lighting ever. I mean, it's porn light. Yep, definitely porn light. I agree. Oh yeah, we... I never got to use this outside of this one time. So I must have missed a lot of shit. <laughs> My, it's... It's quite long. long. It extends. <laughs> what kind of fucking cyberpunk nightmare is that? Earth, Don't marriages. worry, it can extend. Mm -hmm. Mr. and oh, Mr. Robert Hall oh, of Silver Spring announced the birth of their daughter, Marilyn, on June 10th at White Oak Hospital. A lady and Stephen Wright of North Park announced the birth of their son, Maurice, on June 10th at White Oak Hospital. On behalf of their daughter, Lucinda Monday, proud grandparent Irene Monday of Silver George and Irene Monday, Silver Spring announced the birth of their grandson, Hector Valon. Hmm. On June 11th at White Oak Hospital. The last one was ringed around. Yeah, don't put it back up where it belongs, huh? Yeah, fuck that. Balcony. Ah, uh, what's the worst that can happen? Look at this wallpaper. Yes, it's, um... This um, is old as hell. Everything here is old as hell. I was expecting an old exterior, but remodeled inside. Everything and I was expecting is... you to shut the fuck up. Can't <laughs> be easy all the way out here. He sh like the killer just comes out. I am one man. You have to give up the gold. <laughs> this shit takes time. That would be so good. Rod is gonna uh, set in. Hello. Rod I kill people impressive. every goddamn what? week. I can't also don't here. I can't do repairs all the time. Distant. Can't place it. It's decay. Decay. Ah, oh, that's the one. Click. Oh, click. Manny Sherman. I am a killer, not a carpenter. <laughs> but that that Abe's business car you says he's a builder and architect. So liar. What's this? Architects aren't engineers. <laughs> You've been doing your research, haven't you, Special Agent Monday? What are my favorite television programs? Describe my first pet? What were your friends like as a child? What is this? You're taking a survey, you're trying to learn something. What do kids
kill you to be direct. You wanted to know what inspired me? As if I wasn't an original? Well, maybe there was one man I found myself a little fascinated by. Henry Howard Holmes. Why? Not Ronald McDonald. Because he was Because he had a farm. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. The guy invented the trade. <laughs> he set the benchmark, you know? Learn your history, Monday. Read a book. You think because I stuck a blade in some people and get off on it, I'm not smart? No, I just think you're a psychopath. I, uh, allegedly killed 13 people before you got smart enough to find me. Serial killers are scary for one reason and one reason only. They're mostly pretty clever. Island beaches with dead in general. Fish, animals in the wood. That's why I say mostly, but not all. Is, it's dead as hell. Some only get caught because they want to get caught. Yeah, or they get bold because they believe they are so intelligent that... Yeah, they, 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 they have a general weakness in wanting to read about themselves. Yeah. General narcissism is a problem for them. Yep. Let's go. Can do it. Bonk. I know it. It fits just in there if you just. Speaking of murders, <laughs> let's let's take a moment to congratulate USA on their mark for 600 mass shootings uh, in this a year. This year so far. I mean, uh huh. I mean, 600 and, uh, 601, actually. Wow. I think, to be honest, uh, I'm surprised you don't mention the fact that the, le the right-wing media is already going like, yeah, Talk but I mean, it, makes, it makes sense. It's because of the LGBTQ, oh, all the letters. Mm -hmm. It's because of them this is happening, not oh, because yes, that we yes. are, you know, <laughs> fucking trading hate here. No, no. I'm LG... LG HD TV plus. I would say. Uh, is it LGBTIA plus? I I can't remember. No, anymore. it's L LGBTQ plus. Um, but I've seen like a million versions by now. I'm. I, I would say that uh, if you want to see a good idea of how propaganda works, one thing is like watching fucking Russia. That is amazing. Or North Korean, but. Watching like some of the Fox News shows is legitimately going holy fucking shit. I mean, for me, it's one thing is like Russia and mm. I mean, Russia Not has a dictator in the making. I mean, he, he has been a dictator for a while. Yeah, it's just been not a dick his, 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 his whole life. <laughs> he's been a dick for a while now. He's been a dick for a while now. That is completely true. Mm. But compared to uh, the current uh, leader of North Korea, he's nothing. Yeah, true. I mean, for fuck's sake, he he wanted to show a uh, sign of strength after his dad died. So one of his ex generals, yeah, he's dead by mortar cannon. Yeah, by mortar fire. Not only what that, the but that? the amazing feat of his father is that he has managed to make a dictatorial succession by I godlyhood. Mean, by to be fair, you can't really pin that on uh, Kim Jong Un's father. You have to go one generation was grandfather. further back. Yeah, grandfather. Yeah. But that, grandfather... that is insane. But do remember, but we for we are forgetting one thing, Isa here, and it's, it's very important. And it, we and it's very important we know this that in North Korea they have found evidence of a unicorn. Yes, yes, uh, and and a, and a flying horse on the moon. I mean, the and, Bible has mention of unicorn doesn't make it that and, factual. And we need to, we don't need to forget who made the first hamburger. That was Kim Jong Un. Of course. And Kim Jong Il, Il when he was five, he shot a rifle at a hundred meters, twelve bullets, all of them bullseye. And I mean, the current one has actually done a uh, a golf court eighteen. 18 whole gold cards in 18 strikes. Yeah, all hole in ones. All hole in ones. 
the fun thing is when you see like some of the documentaries when That's when you hear legit. the when you hear no, but the fun thing is when it's the North Koreans who tell it, and then you see like one just really, and you can just see mm hmm, and you go like. Bitch, you fucking know that's fucking a lie. The worst part is I think some of them actually believe it, and the rest of you, you can't say anything else because you're dead. I mean, for fuck's sake, you can. Of course they believe it. They don't know what they don't know better. True. The ones who run away do. But uh, the, the but um, fun thing that we came from. But again, it's just sad to be honest. Yeah. With so many school shooting or ma oh, sorry mass shootings, mass shootings, uh, and the thing is, again, don't really care that much about uh, American politics or sorry the United States politics, but it's just sad the fact that every time they try to speak about it and they say, well, it's not the problem with our guns. No, it's never a problem. No, with no, guns. it's it's never a problem with the guns. It's not the gun. What we need is good people with guns. Yes, because your Teachers, police has, has a this. excellent reputation as well regarding their weapons. The, the worst so part for me is that they don't learn. Mm. I still find like the most hilarious stories about like a, a tourist coming to the United States. He borrows a car and there's a problem with the car, so he's get pulled over in immediately by the cops. Hmm. And he doesn't think about it because he's just he just arrived. So he gets pulled over, and immediately he goes out and walks towards the police station. And the police officer says, "Sir, I know for a fact you're a tourist. I know the car. I need to tell you, don't do this. <laughs> you will be shot on sight." Yeah. I mean, I think it speaks volumes the the whole attitude they have when stopping a car because at the when I. I used to watch cops, mm. and I started noticing that whenever they pulled someone over, they would walk behind the car and put their fingers, they put their hands somewhere on the car, like it was either on mm. on one of the lights, on the trunk, they, they pretty much touched the car, right? Mm. And I'm like, why do they all touch the car like that before approaching the, the driver? So I went on, uh, I went to Google to see why do, why do American cops touch, uh, touch cars? So basically they do that to leave the fingerprints on the car they stop. Yeah, in case they run. In case, in case anything happens, the fingerprints is on the, on the suspect car. What are you worried about, miss? Always be what? camera like, ready. Wow, that's... You look amazing as usual. What backwards country has to... The what cops the... have to do this in case something bad happens. I mean, what the fuck, man? Okay, again, it's... I feel like I don't want to diss them, but... it, it To me, it's just so... Oh. It's weird. Yeah. Oh. We're spoiled. I, I, I think the problem is that we're spoiled. Mm. Mm. I remember so, what those do. So these are some of the items, or like. Yeah. If NPC you look at this, uh, this is the necklace and the ring from the mm. people who died in the very beginning. Mm. Basically. That's her wedding. But... That's her wedding ring. I still feel like also the most important thing you have to point out is that it is the very loud minority that the rest of the world goes like, damn, be Check this out. because I have this is no jump scare coming. That there are so many intelligent Norris? American oh, jump scare. Jump scare coming. Be, oh. be ready. Okay, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Even with the warning. Yeah, now. but at least it is, it's less of a help. It, there's a second jump scare. Just, <laughs> just wait. <laughs> See? Well, what is it? Some kind of animatronic? Yep. A fucked up looking. Yeah, a animal? It can't hurt you. It scared you. It scared you twice. Scared you, it scared you twice. Hey, Charlie. And from a dimension you just see my face, it scared the fuck out of me! <laughs> you didn't get anything. There's still time. 
Come on. Let's not keep Charlie waiting. Oh, Barry, no. I was, I was fucking told. <laughs> no, I'm sorry, Barry. Hey, Barry, no. We're sorry. Blowing up on me when all I did was my job. I'm the one doing the talking on camera, not him. Barry, oh, I feel your pain. On him and you know it. <laughs> I was told and I was like, okay, I'm you ready for it. Guys. No, I wasn't. This is on him, Mark. I will do this. And there's a cat here looking at me intently. You can see the, you can see the time. <laughs> Somebody wants his treat. <laughs> so we'll have a very quick be right back. And I'll uh, just give him his treat so he doesn't sit here and stare at me for 10 more minutes. <laughs> Enjoy. Don't muffle us. I will not your, muffle your you. Audience will be we will be alone. I will not muffle you. I'm just going to double check that I'm not <laughs> muffling anything. That was that was legitimately fucking. Ah, <laughs> I, I fucking hate it. It's okay, Nor. we <laughs> go. So I take it then that uh, Isa's little chat can hear us now. I believe so. How lovely! Easy, easy to easy to find out. Mm -hmm. Is is yes, they can. Yes, they can. <laughs> Good to know. Thank you. This time Isa hasn't cut us off from you guys. Mm. I will be right back. Don't forget that... to follow her on the socials. Um, <clears throat> I was about to ask, is, is this a drawing of yours? Pardon? Uh, like her waiting screen. No. Hmm. That is not mine. No. Her stream has, uh, it's in terms of... Uh, Intro, intermission, and handing are not mine. Okay. Yet. <laughs> Yet. Because eventually shall be in the making as well. I will look forward to see it. Oh, such a word. Okay. I'm actually also looking because there is like... Uh, deals here in uh, on Steam, games that might be interesting to play. Together. Alice, like. I mean, there is get the fuck out, but uh, again, it it's still quite expensive, I would say. But there is a there is a um... get the fuck out. GTFO. Oh, GTFO. And then there is like other games, like small multiplayer games, like uh, restaurants where one has to, be, two have to be waiters, two have to be cooks, and yeah, working together. Those, those type of games open a lot for chaos, <laughs> especially for. Oh my god. DLC for your games. Civilization 6, Portugal pack. Fuck yeah, Portugal! <laughs> or as we say it, Portugal, can I do? Oh, I say Jesse. Nah. Oh, Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. I've tried playing Warzone, but a Unfortunately, my computer is not good enough to actually play it. Uh, Teddy and I were looking into Grounded, but I believe Nate would know part of it really fast. Grounded? Yeah. Uh, why would he not be a fan of that? For one, Nate doesn't like spiders. Oh. Well, in general, neither and, or it's and like... grounded, yeah, you're tiny, uh, so spiders are huge. And mm. apparently, there's wolf spiders. Yeah, okay, I highly. So love yeah, that. at the first the first moment, Nate would see a wolf spider. Yeah, uh, okay, he would fucking. Yeah, hate he would know about. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> going medieval now includes cats. Oh, medieval kitties. Medieval kitties. I'm back. Join the back. witch. Uh, there is green hell, which is like the forest. Cat now be happy. Cat has treat. I can't wait for the forest too. I have a pretty good idea of what is going to happen with the four of us. Yeah. Chaos. <laughs> Chaos like, is with always. City, right? like with any other and game. But page, I need to point out, to if it. there's no gazebo, I will help, flip my shit. It back in my face. Because, you're, because he thinks you're just trying to get content for your showreel. <laughs> what if I was? Charlie does seem to think he owns us. So damn controlling. I don't let him control me. Why else do you think we fight so much? Did you know Aaron has no immature. Weeks? He told her that learning from him was its own reward. That piece of shit. That's almost like so saying that uh, I will give you exposure instead of money. He's shopping like he can't do anything for himself. Doesn't matter. Oh, do One not come another, at me with that bullshit. Fuck your exposure. Yeah, exactly. Good for you. That's... That's More like what he said, like right being around and learning from him is payment yeah. enough. Sounded very sincere. Because it is. Charlie would replace us in a second if he wouldn't be inconveniencing himself. He's using us. I deserve better than this. So do you. We all do. Okay, uh, C-Steam, that's a lie. You might like Bendy and the Dark Revival. No. No, yes. Steam, I wouldn't. Fucking Oscar worthy. You don't know what we were talking about. <laughs> I heard enough, thank you. I know what betrayal sounds like. I'm particularly disappointed in you, Mark. Whatever your future plans may be. Oh, right, I need right to do now, the voting. You work for Lonit Entertainment. Hmm? And Lonit Entertainment employees are meeting for dinner to speak with our host. Charlie, I'm sorry. And Lonit mm, employees really. are professionals, yes? So start acting like it. Ah, uh, voting. Abby, you have a future. What is the voting? Steam Awards. Oh, man, there we go. <laughs> somehow we all sing to his <gasps> level. Okay, from the year. I agree with that man yeah. as a child. Damn, I'm kind of torn between stay, Stray and Scorn. Mm, for me, it's Stray. Oh, there it is. Uh, says it's called Played Up. Oh. I'm oh, surprised your maker. game of the year isn't a query. Hmm? I'm surprised your game of the year isn't the quarry. Nah, straight. I got to play a cat. It wins. Yeah. Or game of the year is gonna be straight for me. VR game. I, I have to admit game. though that I, I really look forward to doing the ass hat run where we kill everyone. I think it's okay for Just to see how bad love. this can be. <laughs> Has anyone seen Mr. Dumet? Shouldn't we wait for him? Just poor Mark. Hmm. He doesn't show up to their own dinner party. He doesn't show up to their own dinner party. None of you did anything to piss him off, did you? I think it's gonna be no, eight. Or... I haven't seen a soul here aside from the groundskeeper. He's probably cooking dinner himself. Better with <laughs> friends and then they're straight. I that's impossible. Hair. We started on the wine. Hope that's all right with Dumet? you. Yeah, that dude ain't gone. Uh, Wait, uh, has no why? better with friends. I saw all the snide things you tweeted from his limo. I didn't. What are you talking about, Jamie? He got back aboard the ferry and left. What? When? Right after we got to our rooms. He just left. You're sure? It's called I'm running away. You must be mistaken. I'm not blind. I know what I saw. Why would he leave? That makes no sense. Oh, right. Phasmophobia wasn't really released this year. Yeah, big nope. ass hurry. Guess you were right. There was some kid here. I saw them together. When I Outstanding was visual room. style. That has Another to be scorn for me. Perfect Charles Lonnet plan comes together. What's our next step, boss? Swim for shore? Why would he invite oh, us here and to dinner and then just leave? I'm sure he has his reasons. Who knows what could have cropped up? Maybe he ordered pizza for dinner in the dock as far <laughs> as they deliver. This could work to our advantage. How? Well, think about it. We're still here, surrounded by perfect... Most innovative gameplay awards. Right. 
Huh? We shouldn't leave too Ray. Ray. <laughs> Guys, am I the only one who's getting really freaked out by this place? We get to be a cop. It wins everything. As much as it pains me <laughs> the you suck at the war. I know. I'm sure I didn't decide with Jamie on this one. Thank you. Lower your voices. Why? He's not here. But that's How does even better the masquerade blood hunt? We had to go back to establish an alibi. What are Best you know, soundtrack. So that equals game of the year. On the yes. other side of the lake, he has plausible deniability. Ah, <sighs> 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 best. Best soundtrack. Score. Okay, fine. Just don't come crying to me Sorry. if you end up dead. What is wrong with you? I'm just saying. She's the mm -hmm. only one that calls out this shit. Guess you never found your cigarettes. Incorrect. I found. I wonder that what would happen, you think, if we did a full run where we'd, where we'd just say nothing? That would be interesting. Should we add that to the list? So what are we doing? <laughs> we just gonna. So yes. save all, kill all, never answer anything. Always go for say nothing. The plan. Sit back and relax a word score. We're going to sit with our thumbs in our asses <laughs> until a panic deadline looms over us and then we'll just throw some shit together and I'll save it with a voiceover. I mean, it's not. Actually, for me, it's card telling simulator. Mm. Uh, wow. Game of on the go I think Nobody for me it's house The worst decision Charlie has ever made. Although I don't think that came out this year, so... No, it didn't. Mm -hmm. Now, I would like to toast all of you. That's going to be so awkward when I mean, he gets up to toast and we go say nothing. Oh, Stray. Mark and Jamie, the two of you do the work of a team. Outstanding story reach game. Despite our bickering, the quarry. You are the heart of this show. You keep people interested. Soundtrack. And finally, to our newest recruit, Erin, we would be lost without you. Who else could we trust to remember every little detail? Yeah, I'm gonna say Stray again. Thank you all for your hard work. Cheers. Cheers. To us. So we are nice us. again. This gave us an achievement last uh, time. Lever of love, Toasty. ladies. What we can get here can take the show to the next level. Sure, if we have time to get it all. Yeah, he totally heard us. Nah, no way he'd say all that nice shit if he heard us. Maybe we shouldn't talk about it right this. But second. you're the one who brought it up. You brought it up. <sighs> what was that, Kate? Nothing important, just spitballing some ideas. I think she'll look best if we can really make the backgrounds look as creepy as possible. Shouldn't be hard. Um, does anyone else think it's weird? Dumet hasn't shown yet. They just told you that he yeah, left. I don't Come think on. he's coming. What do we want to do first, Charles? Heard about the boss. Thank you. I think it makes sense for us to start in the lobby. There's still decent light to work with, and it's symbolically where things would begin in the murder castle. With what light's already in there, we just need to set up a couple of our own. We can make it look as if it were lit by gaslight. Perfect. What if Dumet shows up? If he tells us to stop, I'm going to be having a strong word with him. He's put us in this position. All right, everyone grab what they need, and we'll meet in the lobby. Well, this is wrong. Professional as possible from here on in, please. No mistakes. Perfection. If he comes back, I don't um, want him to see us right fucking back. about okay. or arguing. Good call. We're on it, right, guys? Fantastic. Right. I love to hear that. <laughs> Shouldn't take me long at all. Great. Wow, that's uh, the Great. wine in that glass. Great. It's it's like tilting. <laughs> creepy dolls. Lots and lots of creepy dolls. He really has planned this a while though, with all the dolls being so ready.
Time to save Erin. Hello? Guys? Nah, that's just a room moving, honey. That's awkward. I like this so that you can like, kind of hear stuff from the doors or from the walls. Oh, escape simulator is on sale. Hmm? What did you call it? Escape simulator. Oh. First person. Oh, it's not for you then. First person mm -hmm. puzzler. You can play solo or in an online co op. Explore a set of wildly interactive escape rooms. Move furniture. Pick up and examine everything. Well, Smash some bots, first person game goes fine, others do not. Interesting. That's such a bad cry. I am so tempted to pick up this book. Oh, Tormented Souls is also Let's do it. Um, on sale. Hmm. We think it needs oh, for emergencies. Oh, damn it, I was, like, I was actually gonna ask, is there a, the ring game now? No, it's a DLC for Dead by Daylight. Oh. Oh, well. Or just put your headphones on. Now we put the book back. Good. That's crying though. Make sure they fill my pine box with cement. Put me deeper than anyone else. And cover the ground with more cement. Cause trust me. Just being dead ain't enough to stop me from killing again. Hanging of HH Holmes. And look at that sneaky camera on the side. Sneaky. That is not so sneaky. No, it was more... It's... That's so cool because that's, I think that's the walls moving. She can hear with her equipment. Oh, there's a premonition. Let's go! Yeah, well, that's how she dies. If you attack, that is how she dies. It's a very early death, really. Because this wasn't open earlier. Oh no. Never good to hear opera music in this game. It's like a death warning. Hold it. That actually sounds a little bit like somebody we know whimpering. <laughs> That's mean. Just for a couple of actual, seconds. Of the... <laughs> actual, but mean. <laughs> Just that, that part of the sound. Apart from all of it. Who saw? So. 
Sounds such like a lovely end. And you hear the castle hey, move. Oh. <laughs> it's like because of her equipment, you hear it when the castle moves. Stop crying, you dumb kid! Look, it's a sound box. Ugh. <laughs> Bam. Oh, that's Erin in a in a room with Dolly. Ah, that was spooky. Let's just leave her there for a while, huh? Breakers. How handy that the door was suddenly open. I mean, she has a shitty flashlight, but at least she has a flashlight. Ow! I want uh, better torches from Pasmo, please. Mr. Dumet? Hello. Mr. Dumet. Round Might opening. Be time to join the 21st century, guys. Here are our codes: 0451. Ned Yoke. Ah, the secret, secret files. P.F. Richardson. Life insurance. Mr. and Mrs. Mark Edwards, East 3rd Lighthouse. Like something. Uh, August 3rd, 2011. As instructed by you, we have made the request amend your will. Uh, Holy seal has been added, which states that in the event of both your deaths, the sole beneficiary of your entire estate is Mr. Richard Belknap. We receive, we recommend that a copy of this letter is given to your legal representative for their records. Please remember you can view any of your will and life insurance documents at any time by logging onto your online account. Well, that was the end of their life then. Why does she have to turn the light off to open any doors? It's annoying. Locked. Great. Into the creepy maintenance room in the creepy hotel on the creepy island. To shoot I see oh four five one was it? Alone and without my stun gun. I think it was. Choices, Jamie. Make better choices. This is your own damn fault. I said it earlier, but yeah. Woohoo! Oh, thank God! Something from this century! That the virus system in on itself to do shady equipment. <laughs> Laura! I think this was what my brain remembered earlier today when I started doing things from. Power on. Oh, much better. Light on. Look, see what I mean? Does it look familiar? Yeah. <laughs> 
Big ass breaker. Breaker. Solar Fernalia. 24,000 for a hack. Oh yeah, did you see, did you notice his username? For buying? I just noticed that. Uh, you have username HHH1896. Dear Mr. Clark, Mr. Belknap has requested further renovations to the hotel spa. We're currently negotiating a formal contract and would like the remaining crew to conduct the cost assessment. Mr. Belknap can provide detailed breakdown of the work that he wants. Once your report has been received, he will arrange for a replacement crew to alleviate you and your team for a period. In the interim, please continue to adhere to the terms stipulated in the non-disclosure agreement and treat this period as an extension of the previous contract. Cost assessment. Jesse plans and specifications, Laura Electrics and Sidepep. How old is the dragon? Old. Dragons don't count age, you know. They stop after a certain amount of centuries. Uh, Frank Engineering, Monica, Permits, Logistic, Environment, Other. Wow, she has a lot on her plate. Ryan, Excavation and Demolition. A good answer is Ageless. That is actually a good answer. Oh, shiny? No, no shiny. Well, welcome in. We're uh, exploring a creepy place a little. More, more documents. There, Mr. Belknap, following our discussion regarding renovation of hotel properly for the purpose of converting into a tourist attraction. We have reviewed your latest design and to estimate the construction work necessary. Please find the overleaf, a breakdown of the work, as well as the estimated total cost. The work can commence Tuesday, 13th of January. It will take approximately 10 weeks with an estimated end date of Friday, March 24th. Please contact me if you wish to proceed. That's uh, quite a lot of money. Get the random music in the background is quite disturbing. <laughs> oh. I'm just a fan of opening doors. I don't know why. Just turning on the lights don't suddenly open that door. This is one where we have to find the cassette. There isn't there any light in here? That is so weird. The sound in the background. Yeah, it's from in here. <laughs> uh, it's a little bit broken, I think. <laughs> oh, it's a red button, and we're gonna press it because we will press the button. Oh, <laughs> Now that would get my attention. <laughs> that would get my attention too. Yeah, I mean, like bit... they sing, like we sing at the end. They're a little bit broken. Oh, wait, no, oh, I guess that. Glad that they're a little bit broken.
Damn it. <laughs> oh, scary. Almost pissed my pants. Oh, come on. Why did you walk down there? I didn't tell you to walk down anywhere, did I? <laughs> Apparently, you do this on your own. At the More information we go. Little castle, just like Holmes did. Most people like me do their business where their target lives. That's just asking to get caught. Holmes had the right idea. It's all about the honey, honey trap. trap. You bring me some smokes, like I asked. Lucky Reds. Yes. Oh, these are like gold in here. Damn, that's good. So, yeah. The honeypot. The honeypot. Holmes built a hotel about a mile from the World's Fair and called it the World's Fair Hotel. Well, it was brilliant. And bought ad space in papers alongside ads for the expo. Rubes from far and wide assumed it was the official hotel. Mon Pa Kettle. Take a train in from... Nebraska takes three days. They roll up into that joint, ready to rest, get to their room, and whoops, what do you know? Holmes had a gas pipe hidden under the bed and poisons them. Or maybe he pulls a trap door on them. Maybe he separates them and makes one watch through a window while he slits the other's throat. I think that's basically all the way they can die. <laughs> well, some of them. Targets. <laughs> that's why I picked all those houses north of the airport. The whole neighborhood was scheduled for demolition, and yet, all those lovely realtor ladies must not have gotten the memo. Call up as a contractor. Tell them I'm flipping. Have them meet me out there. And look at that. We're the only two people for miles. The first couple times I wait for a plane to fly over just to hide their screams, but after a while I realized they could scream as loud as they wanted. No one was going to hear a thing. That's what I remember most. Those screams. You can try to understand why I am the way I am. You can forensic science up all the data you want, but you'll never know. You'll never know, Monday. You'll never really know how it feels when you watch the fire burn out of somebody. Lovely little interviews. Lovely. 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 I will get back up there because I wasn't actually done looking at these guys. And checking if I see. Hello. Thank you. Does one of you move or something iffy like that? Come on. Jump scare moment. No? Disappointing. Disappointment. Oops. Well, I guess they had nothing more to, to give. How are we looking, Jamie? Little electrical drama, but we're about good to go. This looks great. Very gaslight. Mm, if we had a grip with some foil, I could get a good flicker effect going. This would be fine. I just got a bit more to do once Kate's standing there. Shouldn't be more than a few minutes. Let's uh, be... We're being nice. Hey, we we saved the shit out the reaper later. It was nice to hear. We're all on the same side. Sometimes we forget. Ah! What the hell? Erin? Oh. Guys, 
Well, she's locked in a dusty room. It's not the best place for her. Guys, I'm really scared. Get me out of here. <laughs> this isn't funny. Please help. Ow. Not yet. Just open the door. Just open the door. Move. Move, Charlie. We're here, Aaron. Just try to stay calm. Count your breath. One, two, three, in. One, two, three, out. We need to break through this thing. Guys, I, I, I can't. Go and look for something to knock the door down. Me and Mark are trying to force it open. And the theory goes. Ah, spooky. Who's there? <gasps> Nobody. If you want to kill Eren earlier, just attack him. But since we're not killing her, we're taking what he's going to give us. Get, get away from me! We're going for a good for the tape. <laughs> but he can get his little memorabilia as payment for the medicine. I know that's one she needs to take. In. At least that, that worked last time, so... Hey. You're okay now. You're safe. What? Did you see him? Come on. <laughs> but the fact that they don't believe her, Somebody that is actually a brilliant tactic from them. Aaron, it's just... Because the doll is there. No. The dummy. A dummy. He, he had a dummy. Like dummy. Charles, you're you're a dummy. Now she's hallucinating shit from the show. I did not. Nothing bad happened, Aaron. You're okay. No one is in there. Let's all just um, down. Get Aaron back. Nothing bad room. happened. I was I'm slammed through a wall and Let's somebody go. cut off a lock of my hair. On, <laughs> That's not bad at all. Hello there, Mr. Oh. Curator. There you are. Hi, Mr. Curator. Fairies shown signs of serious pluck, wouldn't you say? Oh. Now, where's our wayward host, Mr. Jumet? Apparently, he's left the island. How very rude not to stay for dinner. Mm -hmm. Charlie managed to rally the troops, though, and a good thing. The road ahead is full of challenges. I can only observe, and it can be frustrating to watch. In some ways, I envy you. I only record events. You get to shape them. You'd better get back to things before one of our friends makes a poor choice on their own. Yes, we can make, the, make it for them. Let's just all take a deep breath and not lose our minds. No, Charles. We're done. This has been weird every step of the way, and now it's getting scary. Oh, relax. I'm serious. Everything about this is off. It's Kate not wrong. to admit it, but Kate is right. 
Somebody tried to attack Aaron. We don't know that's what actually happened. Oh, come on. She's telling you. In the dark. You think I'm making this up? Everyone relax, okay? Just give me a second to think. Excuse you. I love his thinking. And exit stage left our oh so confident and sure leader. What was that? That's him thinking. Charlie is thinking. Which looks a lot like a temper tantrum. Maybe he's right. If we don't crush this episode, we're all screwed. Are you kidding me? What? I'm just I've saying. I've been waiting on you for ages to actually make a decision about something. Anything. And now this is when you suddenly choose to take a stand? Yep. Because his career is on the line. Sorry. Maybe I'm crazy. But if Aaron says somebody came for her, I believe her. We're not safe here. It was just a dummy. You think I'm lying? Really? I think maybe you're just confused about what you saw in the dark. I know what I saw. She was slammed to the wall and her hair was cut off. Come on. Right. Here's the plan. We've already got a plan. It's for it's out. Just listen. We cannot jump to conclusions. I'm going to go and find Dumet and get clear on everything. Everything is going to be Roasty, fine, okay? Toasty, and we're going to get the footage we need. He didn't show for dinner. What makes you think you can find him now? A positive attitude. You should try it sometime. Oh. Bravo, Charles. Your delusions make for such great plans. Demet left. I saw it, remember? Maybe he's back now. Maybe he's not. Would it kill you to think positively just once? Yes. I mean, yes. I guess as far as Charlie's ideas go, <laughs> it's not the worst he's ever had. It's not even the worst idea I've had this evening. Don't go patting yourself on the back. I still think your priorities are fucked. Whatever. I'm going. I'm coming with you. Whatever. Wait. Do you have to go? I'll be right back. I promise. Just stay put so I know where to find you, okay? I don't care what he says. I'm done. I'm getting my shit together. Okay. I'm leaving, Mark. You coming or not? Bye. Aaron saw someone. Okay, you're right. Sorry. Finally. It's just Charlie said. We're not safe here. That outweighs having a damn job. You're right. Let's go, Aaron. Everything's gonna be okay. Wait here. Can't you just stay here while I pack up my stuff? I don't want to waste any time. One of them should stay there. Let's all be quick. We'll be right back. I mean, she's just been basically tried to be murdered and they all leave her. Sorry, just still freaked out. Can you leave it open so you guys can hear me? Of course. Somebody just had like the worst experience of her life, basically, and they all leave her. Okay, I know, right? Where are we going to look first for the Met? I'm not looking for Dumet. I'm scouting for shots. If he pops up along the way, great. Jesus. You really don't care about anything else, do you? Of course I care. I would never leave you alone you know in that situation. I, if we're set hmm? up and the camera is rolling, I would never leave you alone in that situation. No, me neither. I mean, she's just been spooked to hell. Never read that already. She's just been spooked. She does have asthma. These people know that she does. It's just so extremely rude to leave her. Let's see. Oh, the numbers changed. Look, we had 10178. Now it's 0180. That's the first number change of several. Well, somebody has been on a rampage. Here. I no idea. Darby blood. <laughs> but we haven't killed anyone. Of these guys yet, at least. Oh yeah, that's the one where she's written over. I that people would know where the met went. Yeah, where did the groundskeeper go, huh? On the kill run, we're gonna have to check this book. Whoa, whoa, whoa. And see if it's starting to check us out as they, people die. That, that would be kind of cool. Creepy, but also kind of cool. Our gear is still in the front of the door. We 
Wait, what? What the hell? What? 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 Yeah. She didn't want to tell us what, what. Apparently. I guess not. Wait, what then? I just think, I think it's room numbers, actually. Nothing. Ah, no power. Again. Because having power would be too easy. We have this already. Nope, ow. Ooh. That's also quite a way to die. Cured. Well, I'm not so sure. <laughs> Unless, of course, it means the other type of fuel. You're the meat. Mm -hmm. Ah, yes, the designer card. Hey, I found Dumet's business card. Yeah, one of that's we found designer. all. Designer. We, we found all five, which is basically what H. H. Holmes says in the intro: architect, designer, builder, doctor, artisan. All all the things he brags about being. Absolutely bananas. Dead yeah, well, We know that, but he doesn't admit to that. Didn't you know he's under the influence of the devil? Hmm. Jamie. Just blood. Over here. A little blood. Okay. Nothing much, yeah. right? I'm freaking the fuck out. It's just blood. Freaking out, man. It's, I'm freaking out. It's just blood. All we know is something was dragged along this way and it was bleeding. And that's not a cause for concern. I mean, all right, it's a little odd. Nah. Odd. It's not mine. <laughs> it's not my blood. It's not your blood. All of us are alive. No, it's not my concern. Uh, Maybe it's our dinner. Sounds like someone else's problem. It does have a point. It could also be that somebody's killed something for dinner. Welcome, one and all, to tonight's entertainment. Oh, what the fuck? Presented by Grantham Dumet. Dumet? What? So he hasn't left? No, he has. And listening to opera music is never good. Noted. Generally <gasps> signals mean, death. Does that mean I'm a bad person? Because I occasionally listen to it. Yeah, but in this game it's bad. <laughs> in this game it's very bad news. Like every time something bad happens, I've listened. To, there's like opera music before. Can we please play with Jamie because she has the better flashlight? You may not. Uh, so I see. Oh, hello. Federal Bureau of Investigation. I first met Agent Monday on October 12th, 1997 at O'Hare Airport when I was assigned to welcome him off the plane. I'd actually met him once before at a lecture on criminal behavior given a few weeks prior here in Chicago, but I don't remember me from that. And yeah, somebody probably just spilled it. I was pretty it. nervous. I agree. As the new kid on the block, I was just out of training, and I'd been assigned to drive around this big shot criminal profiler who just cracked the Arkansas case, which was all over the national newspapers. My first impressions were that he was tall. Hey. I was uh, abruptly cut short. Oh. Oh, shiny. Coin. Give it. Oh, yeah, I remember where we are. You have any idea for tomorrow's gaming tree? None whatsoever. We could continue this. 
I'm being a bad streamer. <laughs> well, we could continue this. But that's not on your stream, so that makes it harder. I mean, it's still okay. Oof. Lovely. Because that would give me time to play all of the fun. I and mean, we could look at the. Hmm. Hello. Hello again. Hello. Because we could look at the the videos and stuff that's from this as well. There's quite a lot of information information type videos that you can watch. Bit bit relaxing type stream maybe. Hope I haven't missed too much. Yeah, you just saved Aaron. Ah, good. Then no, we left Aaron because scare. nobody listened to us to her saying, "Look at that." Wait, actually, you may have missed a jump scare. It's hard to say. It was a possible jump scare. Yeah, oh, that was that one. Yeah. A bloody glove. What are you eating? Honey, honey cake. Mm -hmm. Taste. Ah, you hear that? The choicest income. Are you? What happened? And we stepped on shit. What the fuck? Stop! Look! Pressure plate! Where is this? It's a fucking booby trap. You shift your weight off that point. You mind deleting that one, Vendor so Stoics? I'm on it, I'm on it. Okay, Dre's on it. I'm on it. Give me a moment. Um... I chose to take a step back. I want to choose to stand on it this time. I'm on it. Hopefully that doesn't kill him, but I don't think it does. I would, ima I would imagine it would kill him. Jamie. I don't think so. We're gonna hopefully not cock it up. If not, this becomes a uh, death run. <laughs> Benny's face was faster. <laughs> well, he got his nose hurt. For some reason, it, it, it told me that I, I was trying Come to ban someone that doesn't exist. Maybe they kind of deleted themselves, or it was because Benny's face was. Doing it as well. That was weird. Well, he got a nose hair trim. What did I do? Let me get the fuck out of here now, Charlie. I I didn't Let's see go. the message, so I hope it was nothing bad. It was just sell, nah, selling one viewers. Of those, uh, seller, follower sellers. Mm. Mm. Well, I'm on the eleven of fifteen subs. If I get four more, we get another emote. <laughs> and you're not going. We're trapped. You want to be famous, dragon? Jeez. We're trapped. What do we do? Break the fucking door. Well, down. just Google it. I'm sure you'll find it. On three. One, two. It's a three. metal door. Come on, people. You're locked in. Morons. It's a metal cage door. You cannot lift it. That's the hotel shifting. Exactly. It's the hotel moving. Come on, did you not do any of your homework, people? <sighs> this this sort of thing makes me want to watch the cube again. <laughs> the cube? The cube is only cube. good one time, though. I, I know what the don't cube is. It's a great movie. It only is. one person survives. You, you think it's a great movie? I'm surprised. But it's also kind of the movie that I only enjoy one. I mean, don't get me wrong, it's terrifying, but I remember seeing it. I know, I remember. To be fair, I think I only liked the one. For me, it's I mean, more like... There, there's more than one? Yeah. Yes. I, I, mean, I think there's three I, I seen of them. The first, I've seen the first one. There's three of them. Okay, uh, I've only seen one, and it's where... Um, Let's just say that there is, not to destroy like the story or plot or everything, there's a master thief or like a master breakout person and he, he quite quickly dies. Okay. 
while the math the math of jail, this he's a jailbreaker or, expert like he told you the truth about it's being told like he has a, he has escaped from several prisons blah 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 job. not really what are you talking about remember my friend Martin? isn't that the first one it was setting up a yeah it's the first one Finals. okay good that's also where you have the autistic style of math genius, yeah. Yeah. who is yeah. the one that escaped exactly and the policeman who says he can he can read people because it would be I'm confused. Why the hell didn't you go for it? Why didn't you tell me? Things were already starting to get tough for us. Oh, no, no, no. Don't put any of this on me. This is all you. I know. I turned it down because it would have taken me away from you. Oh. I, I guess I didn't even think of that. Getting them back. No, together. you did it because you only think about yourself. Yes. You stupid bitch. Selfish. I selfish bitch. I was about to call her something else, but I won't. I'll behave. Yeah, let's not get ourselves lost out of Twitch. <laughs> Guess I was holding out for things to change with us. Because and you would have a Domino's pizza. I'm still hoping. Mm. Hello Domino's. You should have said all this before. I know. I'm not going through it all again. What if this time is different? Oh, come on. That's not likely, and you know it. Sorry. I guess I'm a little confused. I'm fussled. We better go. Let's get back to Aaron and get the fuck out of here. Uh, Domino's is crappy here, even more so where I live now. I mean, I prefer not to eat out, so in, in general. Oh, Domino's here is good. It's decent. Domino's, Domino's isn't bad here. I actually here, like Domino's. Normally when I make, I'm, I make my own pizzas. I can, we do too, but sometimes, for instance, when I was alone. You should and... start your own business. Yes. <laughs> and when I wasn't feeling very well, I mm. admitted choosing to just buy a pizza. Because it was so much easier. And here's the most embarrassing part. Every time I make pizza, the fa the part that I actually enjoy the most is actually making the tomato sauce. Huh. I can, like, really? spend... Uh, am yeah, I horrible I, I if I say that I normally buy the tomato, the tomato sauce? sauce? Because I like it when you, when you can make that perfectly creamy part and it still, like, has a good tang to it. So to be it barely honest, qualifies as emergency rations. <laughs> but to, to be Ouch. honest, my my uh, my favorite pizza, cool. my favorite pizza to make is a uh, is a duck pizza with a uh, where instead of tomato sauce, you this use uh, cream fraiche, like potatoes, <laughs> rosemary, and uh, almost cooked uh, duck meat. Mm. Mm. Tasty. One day, Norris, we're gonna all meet somewhere, and you will cook. Oh, believe me, I will cook whatever you like. We always got them done the same. That is within my <laughs> abilities. Crispy <laughs> dough. Oh, for the love of head and hand me a die. So, because, for example, if you said, told me, like, to make uh, Duke Wellington's. Beef Wellington's, not Duke Wellington's. No, like Duke Wellington's? Is Duke Wellington something? I have never heard of a Duke Wellington Duke in Wellington. my life. The night it happened. Please make Duke Wellington. Fun. Well, your Wellington, your Wellington is so well made. It's it's royalty. <laughs> Guess I'll have to rape a Duke. <laughs> Ew. Oh boy, here I go. Oh no. Well, now you're fitting in with the theme here. You know, killing people, dismembering them, making them into dinner. Um, but... I have to live with it every day now. I mean, I'm pretty sure that that human is. Sweet. Pretty close to pork. No, we don't. I have no idea. According to those who have eaten humans, we taste fairly sweet and not very good at all. Get over here now. And maybe they maybe they seasoned the meat wrong. Yeah, seasoning the meat always helps. Of course. Why would you eat? Why would you eat human unseasoned? That's barbaric. You cook it. You cook it properly, and you serve certain parts of it with a little bit of chianti. Serve it properly, you you ludites. And you know what you do, right? You you serve a little bit with chianti. 
What the hell just happened? I don't know. Charlie. Don't worry, you'll all be split up. Bye. Here we have a saying that Something if you wanna really, really if you wanna bad. know your body, uh, eat your pork. Long pork. <laughs> the nickname for human meat is long pork. Yeah, maintenance corridor. It's the other white meat. Has to be. Which is are we a white meat? Funny considering that uh, you, pork is red meat. Hmm. Yeah, I was thinking, aren't we red meat? Yes, we are red meat. That's what I thought. Uh, only birds are white meat. Fish can also be white meat. <laughs> Uh, fish is sea meat. Isn't I think tuna is like uh, eating. Oh, that's red again. Never mind. Tuna is a bit like steak. What the hell is going on with them? Mm, and salmon. I chalked it up to him just hmm? being eccentric. There's salmon. Oh, salmon. And salmon. Salmon. Lux. <laughs> Let's just keep it to do. I mean, that is pretty much the same way as Danish. Lux. I know, Lux. We are just more like pressure on the A. Yeah. And Wait, do you, actually, you actually call yeah. salmon Lux? Lux. Yeah, Lux. Huh, interesting. Here is Salmon. Mm. Well, that's because you've mimicked the French who call it Salmon. Mm. Or so in our English, Salmon. For us to find. Uh, the, the English stole it from Portugal, to be honest. Oh, yeah. sorry, the French. They stole it from somewhere. And then and then we get to court and then things turn interesting in language. Sparkly door, you say? I'm not done searching for uh, stuff yet. Cards. Bacalhau. Tosk. Tosk. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, We call it that fish. <laughs> that fish. <laughs> and the, the, um, because in, uh, in Danish at least uh, if you called someone a cod, that meant like you're a f you're a fucking idiot. Mm. So it's so it's always fun to see like old Danish movies where they say, go like you fucking cod. Oh, we have a children's song that makes just kind mm. of like makes it sound very stupid. I'm trying to map this in my head. Yeah, you can stop trying to I map it in your head, honey. It's been completely cut off. Jesus, Charlie, why is he messing with her? Because she's the most easily frightened, the most vulnerable. She and can. That's what these sociopaths do. <laughs> God, he's such a pretentious prick. Oh yeah, that's this door. What? Brick wall. Keep going. Like Just homes. play homes. I don't want to think about it. <laughs> Accept your death. Accept your destiny. Accept potato. Hmm. Potatoes. No, th th this guy needs to accept his fucking death. He's starting to piss me off. Oh, what the fuck? Is that a kid? Damn it. Oh, good. Had a boy. Too. I was worried I was finally snapping. Where's it coming from? Just lying and lying is bad. Here's the thing, just hearing that, and I immediately got fucking goosebumps. I fucking hate children in horror things. <laughs> well, like I said, uh, Nor Norwegian and Danish are fairly similar in many yeah. ways. It is very similar. So oh, well, this... book Molly's. Yes. Get, get out, Molly isn't. But, but here's the thing, and don't get me wrong. Nynorsk is <laughs> it sounds horrible to me you, you heard what I called it right yeah get out well mm. which is basically porridge language mm. porridge language that, that's that's what we think of oh please oh god no like you said we just talked about this right oh long look pork. at the piggies <laughs> do we find long pork as well hey Venus toys what you speak that I line, that weird ass I and haven't pork. eaten roasted piglet in a long time. Pig is tasty. a bloody nesting doll. What? A Russian nesting doll. You know? A doll in a doll in a doll. In a doll in a doll in a doll in a doll. I don't need that right now. 
I'm sorry, Venice Toys, I know. But for me, it was always called uh, Get Out Mode. And there we have it. By the way, Dragon Slayer. No, no. We just focus on one thing at a time. We have long pork. You're right, of course. Because mm. that's human. Long pig. Natalie. Max something. Morello. Yeah, Natalie Morello. Uh, are you? Oh well. Hmm. Long pork. Oh, uh, you're excused, Benistois, but uh, for me at school it was just horrible to have to learn that language thing yet, well. Just did not get why we had to learn. Charlie, I found a way out, maybe. There's reasons. Mab. This one swings out. We can probably force it easier than the others. Stand back. Yeah, me too. Oh, oh, Jamie! Oh! Ow. And there went his lighter. Bonk. Charlie? Charlie. Oh, fuck. Charlie! Charlie! And we're back to Erin. I know somebody. Poor girl. There. She goes through a lot. That's somebody else's breath. Would you like a jelly baby? Yes. Give it to me. And somebody locked the door on her. They gotta hear this. Wait. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> if you listen very closely. <laughs> He really can't be here. <laughs> Charlie? Mark? Jamie? 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 Yeah, that, that's Black not ominous at all, is it? I'm gonna be honest, I will I would have shit myself in that very moment. Uh, don't go in there, don't look at all the dust. Oh, come on, come on. Stop being so. Cover your dead. mouth. We got ourselves on an inhaler at least, so... Stop being such a wimp. Give me a sec, let me find what I can use as a fucking weapon. It doesn't need it here, so we're not using it. It gives us a bit of a weird uh, walking thing for a little while, but I didn't use it last time. So I'm thinking we're gonna need it later. Oh, yeah, uh, what is that effect? It's uh, her being anxious or having a hard time breathing. Oh. Sis, can't you see what it is? It's when you have an asthma treatment attack. For treatment for what? That's a good question. It doesn't question. work like Genuine that snake me. oil treatment made from the fine skin I mean, cobra. To, to be fair, now that I think about it, because when I get like an extreme allergic reaction, I don't want to say that's how I feel like, but... Every source of light that I see makes like rainbow colors. The Silver Ash Institute. So I can't that is really. Weird. Oh yeah. So uh, I can't... If anyone's so if I... like really not into needles and shit, this is a bad place. Ah, I'm good. It's also jump scary. Thanks for the Prepare heads up. yourself. I'll still scream like a little bitch, but. Yeah, but it's, uh, I mean, just look at what we just walked into. And I'll be here to clip it. Mmm, how nice. Lovely, right? Right? We'll have a closer look at them soon. For sure, oh, she's pretty smart. First aid. I mean, to be fair, the face. This is like there, the most jump scary thing ever. I mean, it's begging to be jump scared. Yeah. Hmm, a set player. Why, thank you. I'm gonna touch it. I 
That sounds like Charlie, doesn't it? But we know from playing through, we know that's mm. fake. Just gonna find everything else, like, very quickly. Yeah, she's being... Hey, look at that, she's be really being bullied in a way. Fuck you, Jamie. Who's security in the picture goes to totally your type? You're so predictable. Who, Erin? Please, my type is a badass bitch, not timid woodland creature. She's shy. She's clueless. Her face looks lost and confused. What a bitch. That means bitch. By the way, the guy, or like the doll that looks, it looks like he's been watching a certain movie. Yep. What the hell? But did you see his face? <laughs> yeah, animatronics. Boop. It looks so real. Boop. Boop. Oh, what is this? <laughs> He just looks like a guy who has seen too much fairy porn. Yep. <laughs> and... It just kept replaying the message. I'll get them to you this weekend. Just get it done. I think we've gone through everything. Hello, next room. <laughs> there, Mr. Thompson, why don't you leave me the hell alone? There, Miss Monday. Try to contact you by Monday. telephone number for weeks regarding your son's recent behavior in school. Hector has been lashing out frequently at other children in an aggressive, threatening manner. During gym class this week, his teacher noted he could come to school with severe bruising on his legs. We're very concerned about his welfare. Please contact me at your earliest convenience. Yes. At your earliest convenience. Yes. Mr. H. H. Holmes. Oh, we have another one. I'm just gonna see if we can find a coin first, just in case there's a coin here that we can see. Aaron, hello? Jamie. Jamie? That was apparently time then. Aaron? You there? Uh, hello? What is happening? What? You're not safe. Oh. You have to listen to me. Oh. Do exactly as I say. Put your finger in my mouth. Jamie, what is going on? Where are you? I don't. Just listen. Listen. There's a cupboard in there. You have to get inside right now. Alrighty. What are you talking about? Just hide, Aaron. Why are you telling me this? What's happening? Aaron, now. Open the Just mannequin's hide, tongue. <gasps> Yes, you you're told, Erin. You yes, as you're told. Oh, shut up. <laughs> Shh. <laughs> Hello. Mr. Killer Man. Uh, now be quiet. And... This is where, as an asthmatic, she's gonna inhale way too fast. Gonna push a bit of dust in and she's gonna go... <laughs> Luckily for us, she didn't. Aww. My immersion. Your immersion. It's ruined. She's not a true, a true asthmatic. 
I'm a little bit sad because I didn't get to press the cassette player. Hello. how dare you! Hopefully, somewhere safe, wondering where the hell. That did not look like the curator. It's way too bulky. Check this out. He looks nothing like the curator. What is going he ticked it back. Are, are we locked in here? Yep. Looks like it, yeah. Wait. Shh. What? Shh. You hear that? Is that them? Where's it coming from? Your ass. Somebody's in the restaurant. Yeah. What's the plan, Charlie? No, he's not. <laughs> The curator is finally dressed, and he's not a butcher. Look, it's Ben again. But you can catch glimpses of the curator in the game. So. Yeah, you can. Which I love. Both as a raven and as just standing there. Which I love. Mark, what are you doing? Just stay back from it. Rope it's out. Only mannequins. So it's a bunch of mannequins dressed like us. Weird? Yes. Cause loser shit? No. no. I guess it depends on how you look at it. It can be cause to lose your shit. Okay, I mean, I wouldn't lose on. my shit, but what I would be super on? cautious. <laughs> like, <laughs> eh, I don't trust this. Uh, Has anyone seen Mr. Dumet? Especially how detailed they are. Mm -hmm. Even even down to the necklace. Mm -hmm. I've seen some shit, yo. <laughs> yeah, she's she's the me? one that goes and says, "You know, we're all gonna get stuck here, and we're all gonna be dead." Now, I swear, listen. guys, it was this size. <laughs> <laughs> so that's how I got this inside my ass. Believe me, you wouldn't believe it. God, fuck never. I have to, I have to say so many stupid things just because it actually freaks me the fuck out. Makes it easier. Right? I mean, uh, uh, so You're do going. we. It's not a coin. I think, coin, the, it's I, I think it's the common dominator in this group is that we say a lot of bullshit. Hmm. For funsies. Mm hmm. The man? Yeah, that dude. There has to be a legit reason he left. We're adults, I think. Chucky, 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 Footsteps. And they're getting closer. So I'm gonna stand here by the door. Oh, here we go. You know, you should have stood by the other side of the door, not yep. that. I agree. The door opens the other way. Mm hmm. I also am not interested in hitting anyone. I know who's coming. Jamie, <laughs> thank God. Last time I hit her in the head. I'm so glad to see you guys. We have to get the hell out of here. No. Oh my really? God. We do? What, or what? What? Not? Are you no? sure? I'm just glad you're okay. Demet killed his groundskeeper. What? Right in front of us. Oh well, you think you did? It's a setup. He was wearing a mask, and I know how that sounds, but I'm not joking, and now he's after Aaron, so we need to move. Wait, hang on. Where's Charlie? I don't know. We got separated. No way this is happening. You know, so when our bodies wash up on the other side Are you of the fucking lake, kidding me? Bodies dead. Jesus, dead. shut bodies it up! Bodies dead. 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 Knock. And that eye is a little bit too real, isn't it? <laughs> this... It's fake. A prop, or... 
from an animal or something. It has to be. No, wait, it's a gummy. Gummy bears. It's an Halloween gummy. Put it in your mouth. Oh, oh, it's real. It's fucking real. I told you this was all too much. Let's get out of here. Yes, out of here seems like a very good plan. Good luck and with just all... leaving her. Oh, and just God. leaving this, the third one. What's going on? And like a drop with that with all know. the locked doors. Two men. You wanna play around? Get out here. Right now. Come on, paper. Fucking play. I wanna play a game. Of Uno. Oh, Charlie, Charlie, Charlie. Hey, hey, do you guys like to play checkers? No. <laughs> I have a board of shoots and ladders. <laughs> I think we're gonna get uh, him into the incinerator, and then I'll stop after that. Since time flies when I play these games. I've got to get out of here. That's that's not gonna burn you, right? Nope. We're still gonna get it. Oh shit! It's a hint. Yeah, it burns. Also the key it to burns. the incinerator, I guess. The boiler. No, cage key. Kinky. Cage key. And this is also like Hello? Anyone? Jamie! No one? Jamie! Jamie! Dominos. I need help! Dominoes! Can I have pizza? I'm hungry. Womp, 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 womp. Mm -hmm. And they're like, you get a key so you get out of this little room. Are you sure you want to? Can you toss me a sandwich? I'm hungry. <laughs> Can you toss me a salad? I thought you were going to say. <laughs> <laughs> Just fucking eating a salad head at you. Oh, dead people. Chicago killer victim 1. Cause of death, abdominal injuries. Victim's air was removed. Severely sharp object. Also, this girl. I won't be honest. For a brief second, I thought, that's a parrot. John Doe number 2. I'm assuming you've read my report parrot? on the first one. <laughs> Similar MO. Unidentified male with multiple stab wounds. Looking at the lower abdomen, the wounds are consistent with those of the first victim. The shape of the entry wound suggests it's a strong probability that this is the same murder weapon. Cheers. Thank you. Looks like we've got a souvenir hunter here. This time the left ear has been severed. Clean incision. Probably a scalpel or a razor blade. Very tidy. Nice job, actually. Somebody's good at removing in. ears. The deceased had probably been dead for 30 to 40 minutes when this was done. This differs from the earlier MO. If you remember, that John Doe was still alive when the teeth were removed. That would have created a lot of noise and mess. Lovely. This guy is learning. Even more lovely. He's learning. Nothing like a little bit of learn. Serial killer that learns. Pogger. Oh, girls. Tiny. Who's our little pog champ? KD. <laughs> Kill death ratio. <laughs> Kill death. This is just a log thing, though. Oh, yeah, we read that one last time, I remember. Ew. It's more like they, it's the log of what they've done, apart from the what's been erased by what seems to be blood. Get all the blood. Reconstructed all moving walls. Completed. <laughs> that is nasty. He just got a bloody nose. Yeah. What the hell was that? 
The random here listening is just like random footsteps. I really like that. Charlie, you fucking retard. I think you know what a footstep sounds like. I, I mean, I, I would understand if you said, who is that? But like, yeah. what is that? Come on, you know. What is that? Click, clack, click, clack. Now we're going to have some fancy music here again, which we don't like. Oh, come on, you turn the power around, so... Now we get opera music, and as we know, in this game, opera music is bad for you. And we have the creepy doll. Not looking at the if doll I'm at all. Well, if I get out, I'll send someone back for you. Fine mannequin. Mini mannequin. Mini mannequin. It's almost an artist's mannequin. Mm hmm. Mm. Boop. Like, we're just following his game because we don't really... Mm. There's not much else to do. Oh, I can't remember. There is a comedian who made a sketch like how would a serial killer... Because in most movies or and in this game, like, every everything is like timed correctly to how it happens. And in the, this comedian, oh, he's just being like... Where he plays the serial killer, and just like shit, they already in the dining room, and you just see him fucking running everything he can to get to one location. Yeah. And he has to try to be like that silent menace to like, like scary walk towards them. I mean, can we imagine possible jump scare incoming? I don't remember. Hours planning. Hmm. Uh, oh, that's just where we left. Planning your murder, and there's this idiot that practically speeds runs your traps. <laughs> yeah, just like la 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 la. I'm sorry, I didn't see you. There. They could just hear you. They could just hear through the wall. God, fucking damn it, those fast motherfuckers! <laughs> <laughs> Can you stop it? I'm trying to do my thing here. I'm trying to enjoy my murders, and you guys are too fast. The best part is like, let's say that you're not only a speedrunner, but you're like the collector type, so. Some parts are la la la, oh, me. then you turn around and go, oh, what's this? And then you use like an Ooh, hour shiny. to read it because you can. I shouldn't have skipped leg day. Should never skip leg day. Never, never skip leg day. Tick. I need to have a calling card to open drawers with. Oh, coin. We'll take it, thank you. It's a good coin. I don't remember if I had it. Though. You had it because it was a gold coin and it gave you two. Yeah, I think it's a <gasps> little bit different <clears throat> what they give. Oh. Anything here? Apparently, it's just this switch. And it says burn. <laughs> Look at it on the top. Like just flames. Lovely. Investigate the screaming shore. So, so here's the thing. In that scenario, investigate the screaming. If no. I had, if, if that command had been given to me, it would just go, ah, no. fuck it. Just run. But the thing is that you have nowhere to run. The only way is to where How about the no? killer wanted to go. How about no? I would just sit in the end of the room and say, hey, if you want to do this, you do this my way. You come over here and you do your job. I ain't going to do it for you. Doll now on the floor, it burned. I mean, it, it, it it's still like the same See? thing with... Burned. I mean, when we saw like in the first line where it said, yeah, that's what you deserve, you dead motherfucker. Just like... Beat the living shit out of him! Beat his face in! Don't go like, yeah, he's dead. 
Double okay, tap that look shit. at what we have. Oh, there's a packet of oh, scrubs, my dear. Yes. Well, hello, gorgeous. Like I said, after we hide him in the under the the thingies, praise the Lord. Then we will. I will end today's little stream. And okay, we can play tomorrow. Depends so a bit weird. on what you want, Rick. It, it, it's such a weird though. Yes, what, I got my. Like, well, how would who would. Who would react to that in a middle in a scenario where you're being fucking haunted? Mm -hmm. I mean, if you're that stupid, you deserve to be where he is right now. Mm. I mean, the way he flirts with this with a mm. pack of cigarettes, for fuck's sake, I have sex with it already. Oh well, hello there, gorgeous. <laughs> Fuck the fucking killer just walked in and go like, okay, you know what? Fuck that. He just deserves to die. He kind of does, honestly. I admit I'm looking forward to letting him burn in there on the the, the kill all run. Burn! Burn, baby, burn! Praise the Lord. What's he doing? Getting a fucking smoke. The smoking is more important than your life, you moron. So far. Like I said, opera music. Not good. Not in this game. He is about to be toasty. Roasty and toasty. Roasty, toasty smoker boy. Hello! I'm here! Hello! Hello! Mr. Holmes. It's still so embarrassing. Last time we played it where I was like, Who is that guy? Ah, <laughs> oh, look at that. You're lighter. Aren't you lucky? You can have a smoke now. Like, ignore the obvious trap and the fire on your face. Reminds me of Teddy and his fucking upgraded rock. <laughs> I've made an upgraded rock! Blame the bears? Yeah, we can always blame the bears. The whole herd of them. Breakthrough in rock science. Have a baked Charlie. Not a baked Alaska, but a baked Charlie. Uh, oh, I'm pretty baked. <laughs> <laughs> the only reason he survives, though, is that teeth goes up. It made his screams fit pretty well with the music there, though. I'll, I'll give him that. I still think he should die from a uh, gas poisoning, but sure. Oh, well, let's, let's, let's not get too technical. I mean, if you're burning the gas, I mean, t in theory, he should still be able to survive, but yeah. The, the fact that they swapped to this is so perfect. The like, biggest straight to the roasty logs. No. Yes. For our friends. Charlie's I'm a circulator. We're just gonna talk to Mr. Curator first, and then we will end it for the evening. But I think Mark and Kate may be finding a way and learning. Don't ask for hints. 
And how Fine. do you feel about Mr. Dumet's Let's see if the comic. ending is different if we don't end. Okay. Hmm. No hints on this room, though. All hints on the death, death room. I wonder where yes. he sources the parts. It would I feel so bad when I tell him no hints. I know, but... To even the odds. It's so horrible. What do you think? I'm sorry. No? No. Well, I'm sorry See? I asked. <laughs> I don't like telling him no. I know. Such oh, a no. fine man. Such a fine man. You better get back to things. Best of luck. Thank you, Mr. Curator. Thank you. And we'll stop it there. For the day. But yeah, we might play this tomorrow. I'll talk a bit with Ree. We'll see. It's also because it's my mom's birthday, so I'm making dinner. <laughs> Even though we're celebrating it on Saturday, uh, it's still her birthday tomorrow. It's on me to make oh. dinner and stuff. Did it right this I time? I mean, at what, at what time are you thinking of starting? I was thinking of, uh, if you want to, you can, at like, at about the same time as today, like 18.30ish. That means I have time to make and eat dinner with her on her birthday. <laughs> um, so kind of about... 5.30 your time? I go for coffee, but on Fridays that doesn't count. That's okay, Barry. You're allowed to learn. I am appreciative of it. You even work. have your you even have your lurky mode now. I know. I know. I know. Just need to wrangle four more people or something into a a sub before it resets or something. Yeah. Then I get another one. Which yeah. I can advance more work tomorrow until you start. Just skip my my stream day. And recent modes are great. Uh, we'll we'll see where let's see if I can find it uh, where this Thank one ends you, up. Thank you, Bailey. I'm debating where that one ends up yet. For now, it's tier three. <laughs> Until I made up my mind. But yes, uh, then we'll start at about eighteen thirty my time, and we'll continue this one. And you're more than welcome to join us again, Norius. It will be absolutely mm -hmm. lovely if you hang out as well. We. We'll try and finish this uh, no kill run, and if we do that fairly quickly, we'll start the died run of the game. <laughs> kill everyone! Kill everyone Yay. and be the biggest jerks we can. Yeah, that would be the end for today. So thank you for watching, yep. and thank you too for hanging out. You make this so much fun. I love thank it. you for having us. And yeah, uh, we'll be back tomorrow for more. Bye. Bye. Bye bye. Take good care.